My sweet baby, pause for a second and pay attention to what I'm saying. I have a question for you. Are you aware of what you've done? There's no need for condemnation or embarrassment, merely an introspective plea. Do you realize how much your actions and decisions have affected your life, soul, and others? Feel the connection, my darling. If this resonated with you domestically, please press like. You are my most cherished creation, a complex web of love and logic. Each breath, step, and choice you make shapes your life, my child. You may not realize how important they are. Some drag you farther away from me, while others bring you closer to me. But my love for you never changes, even if you've chosen a path that takes you far from me. I ask this question not to accuse but to draw you back into my arms and remind you of your identity inside the life I've known you to lead. Every choice you make, my baby, leaves a mark on your heart. Some decisions provide you with pleasure, serenity, and a more profound connection to me. While some withdraw themselves and cause internal conflict, you are free to choose but there are repercussions to your choices. My gift to you is free will, but remember that your choices affect the present, your life, and our relationship. Consider your life a curved path ahead of you. Every action and choice is like laying a stone. Certain stones, placed with wisdom and affection, are solid and uplifting. Others who pave the way for serenity and satisfaction may be unstable, erratic, and burdened with uncertainty, anxiety, or selfishness which may cause you to feel unsure, frustrated, or even hurt. Your choices shape the path you take. Each choice you make brings you closer or further away from my gentle guidance. I ask you again, my baby, are you aware of what you have done? Think about the past you have been creating for a minute. Where have you been heading with your most recent options? Has someone been separating us or directing you toward me? Perfection is not the goal here. I never expected you to be perfect. But I wanted someone who could see the path to a deeper relationship with me, a path that fulfills my desires and goals for you. My dearest, your words have tremendous power that may uplift or demolish, uplift or injure, bring forth life, or cause discord. Are you aware of the consequences of your statements? Have you noticed how your words affect the hearts of others around you as well as your own? Even when your comments are harsh, careless, or filled with rage, they have the power to cause severe wounds. At the same time, you are reflecting my heart to the world via your love, compassion, and charm. Anything you say sends something into the sector, whether it is light or dark, your words can plant seeds in listeners' hearts. What do you intend to plant? Are you spreading seeds of doubt, resentment, and pain? Or are you sowing seeds of encouragement, peace, and desire? Remember, my baby, that your purpose is to engage in conversations about lifestyles. You can speak life into your community, as I did with lifestyles. Please consider how you have used this gift as your words can build or break bridges. Have self-serving aspirations motivated your words or have they aligned with my heart? This video's wish percentage message was disseminated by frustration or concern to someone who could also be in need of a little grace today. Are you aware of your movements and what you've performed? Every action you take, regardless of its magnitude, creates a ripple in the pond. Your decisions have an impact that extends beyond the moment. Usually, you can't see the immediate effects, but think of me, my kid, and your actions that depend on it. They affect not just your life, but also the lives of everyone in your immediate vicinity, including your friends, family, and even complete strangers you may never see again. Your creation in my image carries a significant responsibility. Your actions should mirror my mercy, justice, compassion, and love, yet occasionally you act rashly, selfishly, or out of fear, while others' actions create confusion, damage, and division. Now, 
I want you to take another look at the selections you've made lately. What kinds of waves have you been creating? Do they stem from pain and strife or from love and beauty? But understand this, my child. It's never too late to come back to me, no matter how far the ripples spread. Because I am the God of redemption, I can make even the worst actions beautiful. Before anything else, my dear child, you should be aware of the consequences of your actions and be inclined to avoid dark choices and return to mildness. Are you aware of what you accompli? Have you not been perplexed? You have allowed this world's diversions to distance you from me. You've deviated from the path I laid out for you by letting anxiety, joy, or uncertainty cloud your judgment. However, I continue to refer to you as lower back. I'm calling you to ask you to come back to me. I want you to understand that you can generally reach my fingers. No mistake is too big, no failure is too profound, and no distance is too enormous to keep you from my love. I can see your heart, and I know that you secretly want us to be together once again. You desire to immerse yourself in the gentle embrace and experience the pleasure and tranquility that come with being with me. I'm waiting for you right here, my hands wide open. You don't need to be perfect in order to return my affection. It's not your goal to know everything. You really want to show me your heart. Show me where you've been off the beam for a long time and take the first step back toward the path of justice. I can help you the rest of the way and it'll lead you there. You've made decisions that have separated you from me, my toddler, but I'm offering you a path back. Turn your heart back to me and repent. Give up the fear, shame, and guilt that have been holding you back. I want to see you experience the fullness of life that I have planned for you because I love you with all of my heart. The purpose of repentance is healing, not punishment. When I urge you to turn from your sins, I'm not asking you to live in shame or sorrow, rather, I'm giving you the opportunity to be whole again, to realign your heart with mine, and to walk in the freedom that most effectively results from my grace. You start healing even though you know your choices have separated you from me. Repentance is a gift that enables you to lay your sins, mistakes, and burdens at my feet, knowing that I will always forgive. I, darling, I don't hold on to your history. Because the East originates from the West, I confirm your crimes to this day, even if you come to me in repentance. I remember that no more. You've carried burdens beyond your capacity. Even though your mistakes have weighed you down and prevented you from experiencing the fullness of my love, I assure you that I am forgiving you right now. My grace is sufficient to forgive every sin, setback, and error. I require only that you approach me, disclose your thoughts, and permit me to cleanse you. Don't take the blessing, my dear. Divide this message among three tired people and allow them to feel my presence through you. My darling baby, are you aware of what you agompli? You've reached your breaking point. You have come to the realization that you are unable to accomplish this task independently, and this is the beginning of something truly remarkable. My dear, your journey with me means embarking on a new chapter, a new season, and a new beginning. I want you to realize that every day is a chance to start again. Each morning, my mercies are new, regardless of your past or future choices. A new day has begun. Today, I offer you a sparkling being, an opportunity to follow my will, walk in the light, and experience my joy and tranquility. You are not defined by your past. With the help of my love, which is constant, steadfast, and eternal. You are characterized rather than defined by your mistakes. Nothing can change that you are my favorite child and reflect on your accomplishments. Additionally, I want you to mimic who you are. Because you are mine, I chose you, set you apart, and know you will touch my heart. Yes, your choices are important, but more than anything else, 
What subjects are you passionate about? Are you trying to find me? Are you choosing to adhere to my methods despite the challenges they present? Usually I'm with you. I can never leave you my kid, and I can never abandon you. Remember that I'm leading the way, so you are never alone while you cling on to your journey. By choosing to return to me, you have illuminated your path and kept you near my heart. And that choice fills my heart with unfathomable delight. Loved one, keep walking in my light and let my love be your guide at every turn. We respectfully request that you remember to support our endeavor to share the truth about God. Just a simple espresso purchase can increase the impact and visibility of our YouTube channel. We truly appreciate your kindness, cherished children, and your gift is truly a blessing. Please know that I am always available to help you resolve all your emotional issues. Present your mischievous issues and unfinished projects to me so I can understand your true nature. There's no need to provide everything in perfect order while you try to manipulate me. I believe that the misunderstandings of those around you exacerbate many of your stressful circumstances, making it challenging to distinguish between your own and their responsibilities. Please remember that you are only responsible for your own mistakes, not others. I'm here to guide you through those complex, tough circumstances and choose the only course of action in advance. Christianity is a timeless progression, an epic journey of change. Certain tangles from your past may also seem difficult to untangle, particularly if they include people who continue to cause you pain. It's crucial to avoid entangling yourself in self-mirrored images or addressing problems. As an alternative, keep looking to me, seek my presence, and have faith in my time to clear up the difficulties and brighten your path. You should acknowledge unresolved concerns, but don't let them consume all your time. My presence in your world serves as a gift and, at times, satisfies your unending desires despite persistent difficulties. I may be a mental presence in your lives during turbulent moments when you feel like you are constantly aware of the whispers in your head. Persistent problems can slowly eat away at your thoughts, increasing in importance until they take precedence over everything else. Share this information with me when you get it. As you work to break free from this agonizing obsession, release your emotions. Recognize your limits when faced with challenging circumstances and submit to my effective presence. A catch-22 scenario may cause you discomfort and consume a significant amount of your thoughts. Given that my concern for you is ongoing, I implore you to assign this task to me. No matter how often it comes your way, include the project and give it a boost. The secret is perseverance. You alter your focus from difficulties to the warmth of my body to elevate our conversations each time you confide in me about your troubles. I sincerely appreciate my profound care for you. Keeping this in mind, I now not only sacrifice my life for you, but I also continue to make suggestions on your behalf. Your presence is an incredible gift. With an open mind and a grateful heart, embrace these moments. Consider me your mentor and partner. But never forget that I am also your ultimate source of life. I am the beginning of all creation. As you go through the time I have given you, Asian, you are looking for the expressions of my everlasting nature. In by your side, always on guard, steadfast and uncompromising. Happy days share with me the pleasures I express and your joy will blossom greatly in the midst of difficult situations. With complete faith, take my hand, I will lead you, dear. Your physical existence is only a wonderful gift, but your spiritual development is an immeasurable treasure. Those who fail to understand my true nature will remain forever apart from me, while those who truly belong to me will remain together forever. You will possess a magnificent form that will remain unbound by infection or exhaustion, thanks to the undeserved desire I use to save you via perception. Love thankfulness for this unfathomable gift to bring you endless happiness. Your moments are beyond my control, 
Therefore, place your trust in me, dear. I'm helping you to be confident in the face of change and uncertainty. Remembering that you are not the master might be a relief of your own ways of living. You will find more freedom if you embody these mortal lives while enjoying my reign. I'm no longer advocating for a fatalistic or passive approach. With respect, channel your power and talents. Look for me in every idea and imitate everything around you. I seek me in the most expected places because I am a master of the expected. As the master of your moments, embody the beauty of the days I have created and seek my guidance to organize their complexities and events. You should not be afraid. Speeding up the procedure can lead to anxiety. So I've cautioned you to maintain your composure. If you allow me to play the melody, I may provide you with a peace beyond all understanding in a world full of dangers and uncertainty. For believers, feeling vulnerable is normal. There is no danger. The skies are your everlasting home, and you cannot lose this magnificent inheritance that is impenetrable to deterioration. All of your life and loved ones are under my control. Nothing can happen to you or them that I don't let. In reality, Ron's creation, the descent in the lawn of Eden has engulfed the globe in battle, transforming it into a dangerous realm where righteousness and evil engage in ceaseless conflict. It is crucial to be calm and attentive. Recognize that you have already defeated your greatest opponent. I've overcome everything, and with my support, you stand among the winners. You will find peace inside me. And since the shadows grow deeper, you are eternally safe within me. Keep in mind that you are the lighthouse of genius in this field. Use your might to influence and propel yourself forward. Recreate such themes above the relaxation, but don't let them take over your thoughts. Instead, focus your energies on making the world I have given you brighter. Use your time, skills, and resources to fight the shadows. Light up the arena with my light. Even in the darkest situations, I am the last light that shines. Your genius reflects me, and I appointed you my beauty. My baby, you masterfully embrace the authentic essence of your true self. Give this message a thumbs up if it touched you. Devote yourself entirely to the quest for my presence, the love. Pay attention to my message and essence to understand my reasoning and thrive in beauty. Being with me lifts your soul by offering consolation and a suggestion. I provide you the ability to develop into a strong role model for everyone around you. Your prayers are not only murmurs in the emptiness, they reach my world of luminous light. Call upon me, and I will answer, revealing to you miracles of strength and brilliance. Many individuals ignore the important aspects of life, but I find joy in those that embrace a desire to study. My heart bursts with delight when you instruct me with a desire to comprehend the great. Your enthusiasm to learn from me reveals the dreams I have called upon you to. I am reworking your mind. My essence illuminates your thoughts, banishing shadows and revealing reality. As you stand by my side, revel in the abundance of the superb legacy you possess and live with me in the sacred town where divine radiance bestows everlasting illumination. There are many secret places where old beliefs could also lurk, but my soul has the strength to find them and destroy them. Your cooperation is crucial. When my essence's brightness shines on a painful idea, it doesn't easily put out ways of thinking. Grab it by writing it down and sharing it with me to learn collectively. Please allow me to assist you in identifying and replacing myths about God. Y'all discover the ability to free yourself from the agony of unreasonable ideas resulting from unsettling evaluations as you reflect on my nature and message. Include the task of repeatedly thinking the same thing, with perseverance. Y'all achieve freedom and a greater understanding of my presence. I've looked for you, and I'm ready to give you thorough recognition. I understand every aspect of you. I understand you completely before a word leaves your mouth. Don't worry about this clarity your trust in me gives you protection. 
You have a special place in my own family. Our close bond is a potent remedy for the loneliness that comes with being alone. When you are alone or afraid, lift up your petitions to me, even though I hear your silent prayers coming to life. I hold your condition close to my heart to brighten your mind. There are no excuses. You may jump right in and ask for my help with your current stressful circumstances. Spend a few minutes relaxing in my company and experiencing the joy I provide. Bill fortify your path, protecting your feet from any errors. Don't dwell too much on the future and doubt your capacity to manage it. For I alone possess the knowledge of your rightful destiny and am fully aware of your capabilities. I possess the energy to change your situation whether slowly or with exceptional depth. I can extend your journey and let you see my community involvement. I like taking care of your requirements and structuring your cases to protect you from unnecessary conflict. Never forget that I am a guardian for everyone who comes to me for comfort. Your role on this journey is to have faith in me, to express your opinions to me, and to travel with me in a spirit of utterly joyful dependence. I will no longer put off any of your lifestyle projects. Instead, I will expand your adventure in order to benefit you and protect you from harm. Joy is a decision, my love. Even if circumstances are out of your control, you can typically choose to be joyful. Your capacity to think and make decisions stems from your elevated popularity inside my sphere. I create you with a brilliance that is beyond the ordinary placing you just below the divine. Your ideas continue to have significant influence since they soothe your feelings and actions. As a result, you should aim to cultivate a bright and energizing mind throughout depressive episodes. Think for a moment and acknowledge that I am all around you. I have given you my spirit. I will always and forever study you, and I will always and perfectly love you. This heavenly power within you has infinite energy to align your thoughts with the timeless principles found in the Bible. The texts instill a supernatural certainty in me. In every step of your journey, look for me. Before anything else, you may know your difficult circumstances, but focus on them. I lead the one I love till you realize how brilliant my essence is, shedding light on your hardships and returning glimmers of joy. Subject acts like a compass, pointing you in the direction of a greater good. Despite the field's significance, it can also lead to feelings of distress and despair. You primarily experience a lack of affection when you recognize my area as a representation of my love. As the early disciples did at a crucial juncture over a topic that both embraces me in unflinching accord and travels forward in its own way while acknowledging my resolve as an expression of love. You will be able to glide through difficult times with delight. Enter my domain with some luck and ask me to demonstrate the knowledge I want to gain and the changes you must make. Are you seeking the confirmation of my unwavering love and welcoming the warmth of my heavenly nature? For as you gaze upon my face, the light of my knowledge illuminates your path. Spread this goodness. Share this video with a soul that may be looking for peace and comfort. Since I am the sovereign of serenity, you need my peace indefinitely. Just as you need my presence whenever life has an impact, it's easy to forget how much you depend on me. Yet when difficulties arise, you find yourself defeated and distressed. You eventually find your way back to me, longing for my peace. You may find it challenging to accept this until it becomes a part of your soul but I voluntarily offer you this precious gem. How much better and more wonderful is it to always be by my side? You find safety, security, and wholeness within my care. You are strong despite the weight of your strained efforts, and you approach me with worries that consume your spirit. You can rely on me to remain loyal to you, to vigilantly monitor your burdens, and to openly express your worries and anxieties as I comprehend your challenges. Take a moment to find comfort in the embrace of my devoted care, because I am your steadfast guardian. You lose your completeness when you veer off course and leave me in the rear, 
The discomfort you experience at such moments is my subliminal trigger, emerging you to come back in touch with your special passion. I want to be at the center of your thoughts, heart, goals, and activities since it's deep inside this harmony that you find a meaningful existence. I'm always with you as you explore the heavenly world with my ultimate decree. Yes, you will encounter challenging circumstances along your journey, but remain unwavering. I have overcome everything within myself. You find complete completeness, complete safety, and complete protection. Remember, I am your ruler, and I have absolute authority over all land and all heaven. Don't forget my essence when you are venturing, seeking my presence, and exposing your burdens. Whether you feel my essence or not, my presence is always present through your aspect, my dearest. Sometimes you may be in a desolate place without my gentle presence, yet you may still contact me, knowing that I'm here and ready to assist. I approach everyone who is looking for me, communicate my call in a non-religious manner, put your doubts behind you, let go of your scars, and want my attention. Then change the focus. Praise my beauty and my majesty, my power, and my majesty, and thank me for the blessings I have given you and will continue to provide you in your life. You will discover my limitless nature, delight in, and comprehend my magnificence in your admiration and thankfulness. My magnificence may become more apparent as you focus on me. My effective essence indulges in the depth of my unwavering love, satisfying your soul's need with the joy and tranquility that accompany its flow. Child, if my words have brought you comfort, extend this gift to three people who are in need of my kindness. I stand by your side, ready to defend you at every step these days. As the Holy Prophet Isaiah said in peace and warranty, I pray that you can find calm assurance in me your divine presence. Lies are your strength, but the industry may also like raucous statements and extravagant promises as representations of potential outcomes. Calm trust in me and my promises produces real energy. Celebrate that I am no longer a dead statue but a living divinity. I am the everlasting being. I once had to face death, but now I live forever. I approach you with love and care, yet my energy is limitless. As you remain in my presence, dear one, share your moments with me and connect with me in unwavering trust. Let the divine words illuminate your prayers. With gentle whispers of affection, come to me. O oh, divine, my vitality, I like you. I am so full of style and genuineness. Grace describes the limitless options and affection I provide you. Receiving something you haven't worked for brings a satisfying thrill. Protecting you from conceit. Grace is a priceless gem that guarantees your everlasting salvation. My grace will never stop shining on you, my love, as you recognize me as your savior. Give over your faith to my boundless love because I have a deep, unshakable, and unrelenting love for you. And rejoice in my salvation. I am no longer only the essence of truth, I am the actual embodiment of reality itself in a world battered by a deluge of documents tainted with fakes and lies. I provide unchanging, everlasting truth, understanding me as the enduring truth builds an unshakable foundation upon which you may stand with assurance. The steady foundation gives you the ability to shine a light on the dark corners of a chaotic and dynamic environment. Let your light shine so that countless individuals might see it too and find their faith in me. The best defense against the poison of entitlement, a destructive way of thinking that demands the world fulfill your desires, is gratitude. Although this misconception is common, it contradicts what the Bible says. Christians ought to avoid any brother who is lazy, according to the Apostle Paul. Paul was a model of perseverance working tirelessly to set an example for others to follow. He even instituted a rule that prohibits a man from meeting if he fails to work diligently. While thankfulness shows a profound appreciation for the riches already existing in one's existence, 
Entitlement represents the idea that one is naturally deserving of getting certain things. If I were to give you what is truly yours, you may end up in a place of complete devastation with no chance of salvation. Therefore, rejoice in my boundless kindness. Only divine will save you. Feeling entitled to more will make you sad, but gratitude will light up your heart. Joy. Furthermore, your expressions of gratitude to me are authentic, brimming with profound awe and adoration. I desire to use the tranquility I have given you as a means of bringing comfort to others. As a devoted believer, my presence and consolation are more than enough to meet your requirements, no matter what obstacles arise. Every task you encounter has significance and an objective. You can elevate your essence and help others through their struggles with endurance. Share your difficulties with me and ask if I may utilize them for my additional designs. When you seek my assistance on a project, you not only seek solace from conflict but also cultivate a deep understanding that empowers you to comfort others through their own challenging situations. Your empathy for their pain will permeate every aspect of their lives. Your capacity to provide comfort is most evident when you encounter others who are facing difficulties similar to your own beyond overcoming life's hardships. It is simple to domesticate a deep peace since, while the struggle may sometimes cause pain, it eventually yields the peaceful benefits of unique characteristics. Proceed. Let me guide you through each moment with absolute assurance. One minute at a time, I light up the road for an unmarried day. If you have the courage to look ahead, you will only see doubt. My face shines on you now because, my child, you find my steadfast, ravenous love in this room. Enter the vocation that enables you to serve as a messenger. By my grace, your donation enables the global dissemination of my message. Join me in these paintings. Click the extraordinary thank you button to get my limitless advantages. My love for you surpasses the strongest bonds commonly believed to exist among people. Even if she were to forget the baby at her side, I would always remember you. You pay me such a high price that I have written your name on my own fingertips. It would be challenging to get you out of my mind. The divine presence in your heart is here to guide you, and I want you to fully embrace my love, which is more than mere knowledge. Seeking isn't really worth it in its entirety, as I enjoy the ample measure of the Divine Presence becoming a vessel that is fully and utterly filled with me. As the only one who puts others' approval before my own, you can fully embrace my affection in a way never before possible. Some of the effects of the fall include humanity's excessive obsession with other people's opinions, worries about social or professional success, physical attractiveness, and stereotypical images. Classified advertisements for cosmetics and fancy clothing often spark a negative fixation on one's own seams. Don't let other people's opinions overwhelm your true self anymore. Because their opinions don't match your lifestyle, I've shielded you from their thoughts. People's minds are often unreliable due to their imperfections, weaknesses, and uncertainties. Even if they flatter you while you're around, their sincere opinions about you could create a unique narrative. Only I can truly see your true self, despite your imperfections. I see you in my flawless splendor, rather than striving for other people's praise. Try to see my eyes on you. My love for you radiates from me. Each day has its own unique set of difficulties. One consequence of this truth is that you must be ready to face challenging circumstances on a daily basis. I'm here to guide you through those difficult times with steadfast strength and assurance. I have my own idea of everything. Therefore, surprises don't excite me. I am the beginning and the end. In addition, I am fully at your disposal to guide and pamper you through the rough seas of life, accepting everyday challenges can increase your capacity to engage fully with the moment your active mind yearns for challenges to overcome. If you didn't have any conditions that demanded your worth, you might find yourself constantly thinking about the future. 
am assisting you in continuing to see my nature in the present. Demanding circumstances should not prevent you from enjoying my company, rather, they should guide you toward me. You domesticate a guarantee in your ability to control, and the joy of my presence increases your enjoyment when you join me in facing them, as we go through your difficulties side by side. Love is steadfast perseverance. The Apostle Paul places patience at the top of the list of qualities of Christian love. Maintaining calm under pressure and staying strong in the face of protracted delays are examples of endurance. Whether rooted in difficult personalities or challenging circumstances, Paul's ideas on perseverance often become less relevant when love enters the picture. However, there is a very positive exception to this rule. Loving parents who, in spite of their responsibilities to care for their children, develop extraordinary perseverance by putting their children's needs ahead of their own. As the fourth quality in the fruit of the Spirit, I want my followers to surround their love for one another with unending endurance. My Spirit, therefore, gives you the strength to succeed in this lofty endeavor. Never forget that my love for you is unwavering and without flaws. Are you seeking guidance from the Divine to share my abundant, everlasting love with others? I look at you today with an endless supply of love. For everyone to see, I am showering you with blessings and wrapping you with grace and desire. The heavens have recognized your steadfast commitment. Divine ATT guides your trip at every turn. Acknowledge the work you do every day. Your strength and constant drive on this journey of thought shine brilliantly, elevating and evolving even during your most vulnerable moments. I truly embody the essence of my life for you, my darling, as you face stark restrictions with unflinching courage and an unwavering determination. I see the weight you carry and the strength you exhibit in caring for those you love. I have seen the weight of your concerns and the silent tears you have shed during your alone time of reflection. Understand this, I listen to your sincere pleas. Every time you come to me with your soul, I am truly satisfied. I comprehend the moments when uncertainty overwhelms you, leaving you to question the possibility of achieving your own goals. I have seen how the enemy tried to sow seeds of despair during those difficult and distressing times. He attempts to set a standard based on your conviction and bravery, but I am ready to provide you with a prosperous life. Join a network where my words will strengthen your spirit and uplift your heart. Keep your faith strong, remain firm in your convictions, and don't let anything shake your position, my son. Stand tall, my daughter. Your second has arrived at a time of greatness in the manifestation of your unwavering perception. Please subscribe now, as I have a wealth of information to share, all aimed at fulfilling your desires and bringing you peace. The moment you have been anticipating is finally here. Vas sure that I'm always on the lookout for your call. Today marks the precise moment I've given you my whole attention. In the eyes of others around you, your steadfast viewpoint will undoubtedly pay off, enhancing your life with several advantages. As I illuminate every road you are pursuing, I will provide you with exceptional blessings and assistance guaranteeing that shame will never again strike you. These days, I provide you a wealth of opportunities and benefits, elevating your life to one of extraordinary wealth. Our onerous debt and the Euro economic mess are behind us. I declare an abundance of things in an attempt to improve your lives in every way, both material and ethereal. Your soul will be filled with joy, and songs of gratitude will flow from your lips in my praise. Clearly, keep your confidence in me, and you will see how full of wonderful things your lives are. My beauty will inspire you, provide you with resources, and create opportunities for all your hobbies. Keep inside you the assurance that I will be there at the precise moment you need me. Hold on to your convictions, since it is that conviction that gives you the strength to conquer life's challenges. Typically, keep a desire alive in your heart. 
Remember that my commitment to you is unwavering, and my promises are unbreakable. I will stay in your life until I complete my heavenly task in a truly extraordinary way. Add in the difficulties and struggles. Please know that I will support you through life's storms, no matter how fierce. He'll hold you in my velvety arms. Fix your eyes upon me, because I am the wellspring of your courage and ambition. While you are exhausted, allow me to make you feel invigorated. I am prepared to reassure you of my steadfast devotion since every promise I have made will come to pass at the appointed time. Know that I am always following you. I support you through every conflict, every obstacle, and every significant turning point. I am by your side throughout every moment of happiness and conflict. As you encounter ambitious choices and reach lofty heights, never forget that you are my priceless work, created with a holy purpose and equipped with magnificent stuff. You may discover the routes that lead you toward justice by looking to my guidance and the wisdom of my words. In the midst of confusion, my essence inside you will provide clarity and wisdom. Never forget that my love for you is unconditional and unaffected by your achievements or true value. No matter how much you have given me, my dearest, I beg you now to accept and incorporate those words. Let them soothe your spirit and lead you. Remember that I am the ideal version of you. As creator of the universe, mother or father of your soul, and heavenly parent, my love for you is limitless and my commitment to you is eternal. I promise to help you succeed in anything if you trust me. At this critical juncture in your life, realize that you are meant to carry these enormous burdens alone. Facing a variety of difficult circumstances alone can lead to exhaustion, annoyance, and vulnerability. For this reason, I urge you to let go of all your problems and worries. Since I am fully aware of your deepest desires and thoughts, I see no need to keep anything from you. I am your last source of support and assistance, so put your steadfast acceptance as real inside me. I'm always watching your every move, even when you're not aware of it. Let me be your guide and give you deep insights so you may brilliantly manipulate the things I provide. I want to raise and improve every aspect of your life as you restore your trust in me, my child, and the portals of prosperity. The universe will open its arms for you, revealing its marvels and bestowing upon you divine treasures that will elevate your soul with peace and joy. Have faith in me, and I will raise your pursuits, your hobbies, and your aspirations. Despite hardship, I will always favor you. If you trust me, I'll improve and enliven you in everything. My aim is for you to flourish and illuminate your lives akin to the first rays of dawn gradually illuminating the entire day. Life on Earth can be difficult and unpredictable, putting your beliefs to the test at times. Don't worry when you face those challenging circumstances. I shall remain faithful at your side. Consider my role in your lives, as I am always a gift, working for your benefit and that of those who value me. Don't let the worries of tomorrow bring you down as I guarantee your destiny. Trust me, my beloved, and I will remove the darkness from your path. If this message has made you feel better, please share it with three others who desire to experience my love and light in their lives. Keep in mind that true satisfaction and abundance extend beyond material possessions. Don't obsess on financial prosperity anymore. Instead, Focus on pursuing my domain and unique characteristics. In particular, use my word and make it as pricey as possible. I assure you that I will take care of everything else. I will fulfill all of your desires and ensure that all of your goals and pursuits succeed under my heavenly favor. I want you to generously share the abundance you've received as a gift with others. Come to me, little child, and find strength and comfort. I will shape you into the epitome of wisdom and courage. Feel free to entrust me with all things. Embrace it as real in my spirit. Difficult circumstances will no longer defeat you, I promise. Persevere through hardships, 
as they serve to strengthen your spirit and reinforce your reliance on me during challenging times. When difficulties or obstacles arise, I will help you overcome them. I will provide you deep understanding and the guidance you need to succeed in any task. I will lift the seemingly insurmountable restrictions and lead you toward unanticipated opportunities, elevating your life once again. I implore you to trust me with your finances, goals, and desires, to regard all of your acceptances as genuine, and to see the divine favor in your endeavors. Keep in mind that I control everything, and I am blessed to elevate you in every way. I promise you success serenity in your family relationships, power, and emotional balance. Accept love and grasp it, because I am always by your side, a constant reminder of my unwavering love. My dear, put your trust in me and let me guide you. I'll lead you into fertile geographical areas and down the paths of distinguishing traits. You are my greatest treasure and the center of my world, thus, I will always be by your side. You should no longer be afraid of the future. As you embark on your journey with me, filled with faith and dedication, your life will rediscover itself. Filled with abundant gifts, your path will prosper if you agree with me, your writer, your parent, and your sustainer. Perhaps those words will also speak to you and uplift your soul, dear one, May the large gifts bestowed upon you also feel my affection. Don't doubt my nature or my statements. Embrace and treasure them inside your heart. Keep a grateful heart in the midst of the plenty ahead. It will help you see the riches around you and prepare you to accept even greater gifts. Continue with steadfast faith in my promises. Working diligently and wisely prevents circumstances from taking you off course or allowing worldly distractions to influence you. Utilize your skills and abilities to succeed in your pursuits. When you do everything with integrity and compassion, you'll see results. Life will help you grow and improve in all areas of your life. Incorporate peace, as this message will restore your soul. Remember that I am the Lord of the impossible. Remain composed and have unshakable faith. I have helped you in the afterlife, and I will help you again. I will calm the roaring oceans of doubt inside your coronary heart. Just as my voice commands the winds and storms to stop. Give me instructions now, and I will give you the comfort you need. I will drive out the turbulent thoughts and anxieties that cloud your judgment and divert your focus. I want your days and your nights to be peaceful. You have a heritage of many gifts, but sometimes you overlook them, allowing your worries about unrealistic events to eclipse your actual wealth. Maintain your poise. I beg you once again to ignore the information, wooers, and threats that others could give you. Even if you bear the weight of your own mistakes, I maintain your strength and choose your fate's path, even when legions of people are in competition. Make your worries more definite. You are my darling, and even if anarchy prevails and others give in to fear, I will keep you safe from evil. Stand by your side and exude vigor and confidence. Don't worry. You'll be at your side. This is the last example of love that you can see and feel with absolute certainty in the modern world. Through this channel, I'm connecting with your heart and addressing your doubts. Embrace me, beloved, and let my words of truth and grace speak to your heart. You will discover a daily idea and energy if you subscribe. I love you with all my heart, and I tell you so now with absolute truth. I'm healing your wounds from those who will disappoint you and erasing your contempt. Have faith that all you have experienced will be for a reason. These days, you possess unmatched strength, deep wisdom, and amazing maturity to stand up for the people you care about and to encourage others who have faced similar struggles. You are currently experiencing the moment of your ascent. Your enemies, well aware of your powers, have returned to disturb your peace and steal your calm. If you allow them to disturb your sleep, lose faith, and fall into fear, 
tension will return, but my love for you, mercy, and the Holy Spirit will protect you even if you fail, and I will raise you again, descendant. I don't want you to think I've lost interest in you. Must you make a mistake and fall for the enemy's plans? Even if your idea falters and darkness creeps into your mind, I will still be there to help. My determination to confront you is unwavering. I will cleanse your soul, replenish your lessons, and protect you from any force that would break our bond. With my power, you overcome every obstacle in every endeavor. You have given me your spirit and abandoned evil. Your words declare your faith in me as your savior and protector. You have shown unwavering and unrelenting commitment. You stand out from those who complain and ignore me when I face difficulties, disregarding their lives, relationships, future, or wealth. They go off and complain to the first soul they encounter. They are contemptuous of my salvation. They violate this holy love by their actions. Yet my love for them endures. My love for them is unwavering, and I will not stop trying to keep you away from the evildoer. I also expect you to continue praying for their souls. Do not let the contempt of others change your mind about what I have said. Proceed. Do not stay in your contemporary nation. And or, I have given you limitless chances now. I provide you with authority that is unchangeable. Boost with resolute confidence and face the challenges and opponents that lay ahead with courage. Your past does not energize the greatness that lies ahead of you. Even if it seems like your world is collapsing, you have trusted me, and I am here to support you. You found comfort in my heavenly form, and you will always have our steadfast protection in my presence. The Almighty being protects you, so you should embrace your inner peace and contentment. Have faith in my essence's power to cleanse and forgive you. Hold on to this truth with steadfast faith. Keep your eyes wide open because I'm about to reveal a magnificent and amazing change in your life. You assert, because of your loyalty and concern for my will, I forgive you. Release yourself from the burden of your previous misdeeds. Stop using self-destructive behavior. I have banished them to the void, where they will remain lost forever. It pains me to watch you grapple with things that have long since vanished. I renew your soul, energize your intellect, and transform your essence. Let your voice be filled with suggestions and energy as you immerse yourself in my spiritual message. Think about my commands and promises. Return to the depths of sorrow every day, and don't depart. You've found your path. You now control destiny. Inside my embrace, behind the shield of my presence, you are alive. I will protect you from the universe's attacks, even if it turns against you. Your ambitious intellect will become even more efficient as you take in the information I provide you. Raise yourself above those that hurt you with their harsh words and negative attitudes making your heart skip a beat. I implore you to convince them to severe ties as well as places that can divert you from your path. I hope your soul will always be alive and burning. I grant you a future full of life, peace, and plenty of advantages. You must elevate me to the highest position in your heart. Give me top priority in your life and keep your word to the commitments we made. You will experience freedom, plenty, and divine favor, my darling. Click to join me and experience the totality of my love and grace. Come and become close to me. We may take this spiritual journey together, surrounded by the warmth of camaraderie and the depth of my teachings. Join your fellow believers now. Listen to my objectives because you hold these words close to your heart. I hold you in my arms and always look over you. I steadfastly support you. Keep these words close to your heart when the weight becomes too much to bear. When grief strikes, remember me and don't stay alone any longer. The basic reality is that I stand by your side. Call upon me. Keep me near your heart. 
and let your tears stop feeding the darkness of the hereafter along with your grief. Refuse to let the depressing times consume your soul. Now, resist the temptation to indulge in thoughts or fallacies that aim to disrupt your tranquility and lead you toward ruin. Recall the lesson I imparted to you regarding the excreting path. I use my strong blood to make up for your sins. Remember my amazing return. As I have come to restore your dreams, elevate your life, provide you with everlasting life, and uplift your soul. You have endured many hardships, but here you are, steadfast and rising. To reiterate, you are my child. My strength is contained inside you. Nobody will stop you from moving forward with your destiny today. As you progress, I will grant you deep understanding. Open up new paths and remove any obstacles in your way. You will reclaim numerous treasured items you once thought lost. Your steadfast trust in my words is the path to freedom, wealth, peace, and the things you want. The assertive and take on challenging circumstances. Don't allow your enemies to weaken your commitment. You've heard my desire to raise and support you. So you now understand my thoughts. It is now your responsibility to follow my instructions. Act as my coach. Give me some thought and follow up with me. Step up and give it your best. You will succeed. You are my child. I have the power to fulfill my responsibilities and I will provide you with everything I desire. As we go through this difficult time, have faith in me and extend your hand. Don't let stressful circumstances and hardships take away your peace of mind and self-confidence. I've always supported you. I have not abandoned you, and I will not abandon you throughout this storm. My ideas are eternal and might lead you to a place of peace and plenty even in the midst of difficult circumstances. My imagination and vision are greater than yours. As long as you approach problems with a positive outlook and an unshakable perspective, you can find that they are manageable. Come to me in the morning, stay with me throughout the day, and find comfort in my company when night falls. Humble yourselves before me, for I enjoy hearing your prayers, even though you are unable to sense them at this moment. When your voice rises in praise, the universe trembles as you walk around with faith, seeking my guidance to protect your loved ones from disease and misfortune and to keep them safe. Hearing Maya's response, I pledge that even if the whole world community abandons you, I will continue to stand by your side. Even if everyone who claims to love you fails you, I will always love you more. I am in charge of your family, your future, and your well-being. Respect, value, and distribute them. Acknowledge their actual value respect your advantages. My promise is that your benefits will increase and that I will provide you with even more deep riches of everlasting value if you continue to be devoted to the little things and maintain what I have given you throughout trying times. I feel a tremendous sense of sympathy when I see your pain. As I have said before, I really connect with your sincere genuineness. I am able to fulfill your wishes because I genuinely want to do so. Declare to me that I will bless you and guard it lovingly during your difficult times. Know that I hold you close. I wrap my holy body around you. I love you unconditionally, my dear. You are loved. I chose you before you were even born, and I gave you a strong spirit that has endured through many AFF fronts. You may show off your bravery again. You may continue to advance after completing this task. I transfer my peace to you. You can get up. Always remember that you are a winner, not a loser. I will give you the power and way to conquer the dazzling world that awaits you. Standing tall and unflinching in the face of difficult circumstances. You have repeatedly pursued my desire, and now, there in front of you, an incredible prospect presence itself. Don't be depressed if you haven't fully grasped the significance of this unique gift yet. Lift your head, cleanse your soul, and, as I often declare, incorporate my teachings. 
the foundation and source of all the knowledge you are pursuing at this very moment when I stand by your side. Don't give up. Keep moving forward with confidence. Don't let obstacles or opponents who want to discredit you with lies, deceit, and schemes stop you. Recognize that loneliness is a myth. I constantly observe you. I hear your prayers, and I discern the genuine essence of your soul. Hold on to your commitment. Don't let it falter. Allow your tears to flow freely. They are a powerful representation of your steadfast love and commitment to your children. Your beloved children should see your steadfast devotion. They must realize that a devoted mother humbles herself daily, sharing her innermost feelings and soul with them. Never forget my genuineness, deep love, and perfect celestial plan for each of them. Keep loving your kids. Even if they don't respond, don't hide your tears. Let them see the weight of their actions. Every step you take is an essential component of the Odyssey, a region of your heart. Rest assured that each of your children has a unique path. They'll fall, but your prayers will protect them from enemies' distortions. Express your unwavering love. Accept the chance to mentor them if they stutter, but always keep your heart open and free from bias. They should sense your acceptance. You know that your prayers are a constant watchdog over their lives, and that your love is unwavering and unchanging. Declare that your nourishing prayers continue to have immense power and produce incredible results. Your soul will soar with joy as you see the fruits of your tenacity and resolve. Rest assured that I love you and your children unconditionally. The mistakes you make are only stepping stones. They no longer influence your life your goals, your skills, or your many talents. They no longer represent the end of my plans for you. Here's where you should go if you falter. Show forgiveness for your mistakes. Keep the enemy's dishonesty and blame at bay. Rise. Sweep the ashes of your descent away. Spread your wings and rise with unflinching courage. My strong essence purifies you. Failure may look like a stop to the arena, but to my children, it is a valuable lesson that they must never repeat. Remember what was is now, and remember the shadows have carved away. Lift your eyes and gaze forward, for I am presenting you with an outstanding task. I call upon you. If you are ambitious enough to say those words and walk with me, I will reach out and give you the crown of the highest calling. Stand firm against your enemies, and you will come out of them unharmed. I will protect you in every conflict you encounter, lead you fearlessly on every journey I lead you on. Let my promises reside in your spirit, tame your idea with my commands, take on your bravery and strength, and drive away fear and despair with my stronghold. I will support you, Incorporate your energy when you are vulnerable, and make sure you don't lose when you disagree. I want you to understand how important you are in my life. I choose to pursue things of everlasting significance in order to prosper, rise, and conquer. Many benefits will find their way back to you. I'll develop a sense of family unity and reconciliation as an invincible strength. I have repeatedly affirmed my commitment to you untainted by guilt, and I reiterate it once more to God, who has approved and ordered your healing. I am the one who created your fate. I have bestowed grace upon you. I have forgiven you for your sins. No one has the right to choose, denigrate, mock, or discredit you. I have given you my favor and devotion. You now possess the holy gifts I earned for you. Don't undervalue yourself or ignore the significance I have given you. Admire and recognize the duplicate as you look into it. The sight of you listening to lies breaks my heart. The judgments of others incorporate these words and maintain them with steadfast religion, rather than accepting the depth of my love and devotion as your heavenly guidance. My desire to see you succeed motivates your advent. I chose you accelerated your progress, and found you in this exact moment and place. Unlucky events, 
external circumstances, or the negativity that permeates your life do not determine your success. No pressure can stop the heavenly gifts, predetermined and sent from the heavens, but you must make a firm commitment to a choice. Will you believe what I say, even if others cast doubtful shadows over it? Will you consider my words or let enemy rumors influence your decisions? They are looking for methods to confuse you, to block your happiness, and to see you fail. As I have said before, their goal is to destroy you. My dear, stop letting them ruin your life. Join others who are looking for my voice. Subscribe and get the sentences I've arranged to make you feel love, comfort, and direction. This choice provides you with the chance to feel profound love, unwavering defense, and continuous assistance. You will live inside the boundaries of my peace, love, and faith. Be a living example of faith. Keep within you the assurance that you have a bright and prosperous future. You find yourself drawn to me, you cherish me, and you have faith in me. Give me your word and say you can always trust me to protect you. Be afraid of those who are against you. Even in the face of hardship, you will see them remain by my side. I will save those who encircle you and plot against your vision. I will act. Ill assist you. In a few days, you will rise, leaving your enemies behind. Enraged people are attempting to subdue you. They no longer recognize that your most devoted guardian, your heavenly mentor, and your savior are by your side. Have faith and understand that anything is doable. Have faith and move. In standing at your side, taking deliberate action, feel the amplification of your faith. You now possess the capacity to cross the seas and defeat all evil forces, engage in combat, and win because you are not fighting this battle alone. You have become fearless. You are no longer bound by fear. Set aside your concerns and uncertainties. Keep your weapon with you and continue fighting. Prepare yourself for the impending favor of God. In each selected situation, you may conquer the land that lies ahead. I will provide the solution and the path. You will heal and uplift countless hearts. Your family will prosper abundantly. Stability and tranquility will adorn your home. Keep your hand close to mine and you won't let go. I am your savior, your restorer, and your mother or father. Express your deepest belief in me and your determination to keep believing. I am interested in you. I have existed, I still exist, and I will always be with you. In times of turmoil, be steadfast. In times of peace, act decisively when you encounter an unwanted force that has entered your life without cause. It is wise to live a tranquil life, trusting in my affection and entrusting your concerns to me. They'll guide you with my calming words, which are really kind in the middle of the pandemonium. Enlightenment will rise inside your spirit, unveiling profound truths as my radiance breaks through the dark shadows. Accept this truth, as it will help disseminate the solution. Through my heavenly presence, the path past your obstacles will become clear. He will cheer you up. He will place a stone of peace upon you, releasing you from problems and anxiety even in the face of hardship, allowing you to move forward with confidence, free from sorrow and condemnation for past mistakes, to grasp the victory I have won for you, and let my spirit fill yours. Accept my affection and the promises I have made. Agree with me, no matter what you see, comprehend, or celebrate. To prepare you for my amazing destiny, I deal with you. Put your future in my hands and let go of your doubts. Exhibit unshakable authority by embodying existence. Trying to help you drives me to ask for anything. In looking for your unwavering faith in me and your confidence in my skills. Strong and steadfast, I embody your ideal self deeply devoted to you. My feelings are pure and sincere. No one loves you or watches you as intently as I do. I love you more than anybody else. On most occasions, 
I have stood by your side and hugged you. You ought to push yourself beyond emotions of inadequacy and keep in mind that your goal is not to linger on guilt and retribution for the past, which I have already forgiven in my domain. Concentrate deeply. Submerge your transgressions into the depths of the ocean. I have the power to render them indiscernible. You must trust my words. Perhaps there's no need to revisit the murky depths of judgment, searching for memories and emotions that I have already erased. Avoid giving the enemy the opportunity to bring back the shadows of the sins I have already forgiven. There is no need to keep making the same errors every day. Instead, focus on the future and the opportunities that lie ahead. Put the past behind you and avoid looking back. I give you the strength to conquer challenges and in the aftermath of hardship. Incredible acclaim will surface and wonderful opportunity will find its way back to you. Your opinions need to be based on how I see you rather than what other people think of you. People who hate you accuse you, beat you, and declare you undeserving of my favor and affection. Alternatively, grace will find you and respond with all the forgiveness and grace I have bestowed upon you. I'm here to keep you safe. Boost with unflinching determination, because I will protect you from everyone who wants to harm you. Accept my words with open arms. Accept the reality that I am sharing with you. Respect my words with all of your heart. Treasure my sacrifice, my spilled essence. Don't linger on past misdeeds. Keep your eyes on the future. Now try not to let unimportant things distract you. I have many incredible, amazing plans in store for you. I demand your steadfast loyalty and am watching for you. Learn about me and do what I say in every way. Focus, my dear, and let your soul find serenity inside the assurance of my eternal love and consciousness. Trust me, since I guarantee you a wealth of advantages in the flourishing of your hobbies today. Now, embody those words as a guiding light to illuminate your path, a soothing remedy for your being, and a holy message to your essence rather than as transient noises. Baby, if what I said has made you feel better, spread the news about this gift to three others who are in need of my favor right now. Realize that I, your greatest self, and the creator of existence and also your heavenly father and unwavering guardian, my love for you is limitless, and my commitment to your pleasure is unending. I implore you to let go of the burdens that are pressing down on you at this exact moment in your life. Don't go out on this trip alone, for facing life's obstacles without my guidance will only lead to fatigue, inflammation, and a diminished spirit. Therefore, I implore you to give me the whole thing. Keep nothing a secret, because I already know the innermost depths of your being and your deepest desires. Have complete faith in me and your confidence. I am your dependable source, your vigilant guardian watching over you even when you're not looking. Allow me to guide, instruct, and equip you with the necessary tools to navigate your journey, as my ultimate goal is for you to flourish in every aspect of your life as you entrust yourself to my care. The skies will open their riches, and pathways of plenty will open before you, bringing you spiritual prosperity that will fill your soul with unmatched peace and delight. I can boost your efforts, interests, and aspirations with every step if you share my energy. I would like to remain your steadfastest, closest friend, even in the face of hardship. If you believe in my methods, you will see how I boost your efforts and guide you to success in whatever you do. It would be my greatest dream to see you thrive as your way of life shines brighter and brighter until it reaches its final splendor. I understand that life on Earth may be difficult and unpredictable, and you may encounter situations that contradict your convictions. You can be confident that I will stand by your side and trust my ideas as we navigate these challenges, as I am always there to participate in your wonderful activities for the benefit of everyone who values me. You can confidently embark on your journey with me without worrying about the future or letting today's problems burden you. 
Success awaits you, not defeat. Put your trust in me, and it'll lead the way. Instead of focusing solely on material wealth, consider success and abundance. Stay focused on attaining my domain and virtue rather than worldly belongings. I invite you to embrace my teachings with open arms. Your sincere desires and goals will materialize, bringing to life the dreams you have nurtured through your commitment. Because you fulfilled my wish, you will bring prosperity to everyone around you. Spread the beauty you possess and remain generous at all times. Consequently, my loved one uses my approach and seeks solace in my grasp. I will strengthen, enlighten, and empower you. Don't be afraid to offer me all. Think about what I know, and remember that obstacles won't be able to stop you. Hard times should strengthen your faith and remind you of my reliability. Call for me in times of convict or misfortune, and I will answer your call. I will give you the ability to see deeply and the power to overcome every obstacle that comes in your way. I will open up seemingly locked doors and point you in the direction of opportunities in order to significantly improve your quality of life. Again, I demand that you give me everything. Give me your budget, your wants, and your dreams, and watch as your paintings and all of your endeavors become extraordinary. Understand that I still have power over everything, and that having me around will improve and elevate your lives in every way. I can promise you that everything works out well for you. Your family relationships may be the most stable. You will have emotional satisfaction and power, and you will both give and receive love because I will be by your side most of the time, reminding you that my love for you is universal and encompasses every aspect of your life. Have faith in me, dear one, and let me guide you. I will guide you into nation states of masses and through the techniques of distinguishing traits. Because you are my most treasured diamond and the light that lights my view, I will remain faithful through your aspect. Never fear the future, I have great plans for you and will always be by your side. If you follow me on a path of acceptance, and dedication, y'all notice that the excellent changes I make to your life are brimming with amazing things. Please press the like button if this messiness makes your day, my kid. You prefer me. You will succeed on your path if I, as your creator and supporter, agree with your faith. May these costly words resonate with you and bolster your senses. May you also understand the essence of my love as it manifests in the gifts intended to enhance your lives. Do not doubt my intentions or my statements any longer. Embrace them with reverence and keep them close to your heart at all times. Show gratitude for what you have in future gifts. Being grateful can help you discover the abundance currently present in your life and give you the ability to embody even more presence. Please continue, my dear, with faith in my promises and a commitment to your work. Information driven. But above all things, remain committed to your path. Unfazed by life's challenges or transient diversions that want to divert you. Utilize your exceptional skills and talents to succeed in your line of work and company. In every endeavor, exhibit unflinching honesty and limitless generosity. At that point, you will be able to see how I extend your efforts and provide blessings and prosperity to every aspect of your life. Your difficult circumstances and hardships will soon come to an end. Stand united, my love. Your courage will reap abundant rewards. Please listen carefully to what I have to say, for I am pleading with you now to resist giving up and to put melancholy away. I implore you to remain unwavering and unflinching. Do not allow anxiety to penetrate your heart further. Do not allow uncertainty to cloud your judgment, even in the midst of uncertainty and darkness. Standing tall. I am able to support you through your difficult circumstances and tribulations by standing firmly by your side. Please know that I will always protect and guide you through life. Therefore, raise your gaze to the heavens and call upon me because I may be able to assist you. will remain through your aspect. 
No matter how difficult things get, he'll be there. You may be sure that I will always be there to advise you. Keep in mind that no matter how far the darkness may also descend, a new day will always come, and with every new day comes the possibility that peace may return. The totality of this life is short, but since the universe is underground, my pledge and those who believe in me endure forever. In the end, just as everything below us will fade, so too will these difficulties and sufferings for your lives eventually come to an end. Trust what I say, because it is the simple truth. The truth I see in you now is that I can never abandon you or let you escape my protection because I am right here, enveloping you in my love and directing your behavior with the greatest intelligence. Toddler, you should always aim for perfection, pursue your goals fiercely and raise the bar for your efforts. Become stronger with unwavering commitment. Ignore what others around you think. Don't let hateful comments or harmful gossip affect your mood. Hearing my call means listening, because I have the energy and blessing to complete your task and agree with your goals to help you achieve them. I can provide you with a serenity you desire, a serenity that transcends all worldly comprehension and can transform your spirit into one of tranquility and liberation. I can always be by your side, watching your journey, and I can really appreciate your dedication and hard work. Y'all soon be able to claim the whole thing you've planted with passion and commitment. You will achieve your long-held goals in life abundantly, happily, and prosperously. Keep your composure in the face of challenging circumstances. Stand together with steadfast dignity and courage because no burden in this life will be too heavy for you to bear. I can give you the strength to resist every temptation and evil deed. Stand tall, for I will always be with you, no matter how impossible your situation seems. It's the current challenge destined to serve as a magnificent showpiece for your unwavering faith and relentless perseverance, dear. Think about it. The more difficult the trials, the better the rewards. I encourage you to walk with me as we grow in love and enjoy my unending kindness, to receive my lessons and accompany your siblings on this path of grace. Click to participate right now. We shall strengthen our affection for one another and our faith together. We embark on a journey filled with both triumphs and disappointments, dear one. Every step you take, whether determined or hesitant, brings you closer to fulfilling my life promises. I am your steadfast mother or father, therefore, have faith in me. Let your heart be filled with peace and unflinching confidence as you reflect on these words and the principles I have taught you today. I am your ideal self, your dependable support throughout difficult times. Fold quickly to me, and you will discover the fortitude to persevere, the courage to face the challenges, and the joy in the victory that awaits you now. My dear, as you reproduce in this message, consider starting your spiritual journey with a unique concept. We might explore new facets of faith, ambition, love, or all the other aspects of your religious development. Amen, my darling baby. Your heavenly handbook is ready to lead you forward whenever you decide to go out on the journey. I want to ask you a question. Are you aware of what you have already done? I want to stir something deep within you, but am not seeking to condemn or disgrace you. Do you realize how much your actions, decisions, and experiences have affected your life, soul, and others? Feel the connection, baby. If this resonated with you domestically, please press like. You are my priceless introduction. You are a complex web of motivation and affection. Every breath, step, and decision you make, my child, weaves into the larger fabric of your life, making your choices matter. You might be amazed to discover the significant impact these choices have. While some pull you in the same direction, others bring you closer to me. But even if you've chosen a path that separates us, my love for you has altered, not to accuse, but to draw you back into love. I ask this question to remind you of who you are in the life I've called you to. 
Every choice you make, my darling, leaves a mark on your heart. A few choices provide you with joy, serenity, and a closer connection to me. You have a choice, yet there are consequences to your choices. Even while others withdraw themselves and cause internal conflict, but I want you to keep in mind that your choices aren't just temporary. They shape your life and your connection with me. That's the essence of free will, a gift I gave you. Think of your life as a course that winds and stretches in front of you. Each decision you make is like placing a stone on that course. You place some stones with love and understanding, making them sturdy and positive. Others may be wobbly, unstable, and filled with doubt, concern, or selfishness, paving the way to serenity and success while leaving you feeling doubtful, frustrated, or even hurt. Your choices shape the path you choose. Every choice I make is a step closer to or further away from my light. And I ask you again, my baby, do you realize what you've done? Think about the road you have been building for a minute. Where have your current decisions led you? Have they brought us closer or made us farther apart? This has nothing to do with excellence. Although I never expected you to be the best, I will choose the path that brings you closer to me and aligns with my goals for you. Your words hold immense power, my love. They have the ability to either elevate or demolish, to uplift or hurt, to bring about life, or to cause discord. Are you aware of the impact of your words? Can you see how your words now affect your heart and those around you? Even if you communicate with love, compassion, and beauty, your harsh, careless, or rage-filled words have the potential to cause severe wounds you are projecting my heart into the arena. Anything you say sends something into the sector, whether it is light or dark, your speech can plant seeds in listeners' hearts. What do you intend to plant? Are you spreading seeds of doubt, resentment, and pain? Or are you sowing seeds of encouragement, peace, and desire? My darling, I urge you to think about the lifestyles you are called to talk about. You possess the power to shape lives, just as I once did. Share your lifestyle with the people around you. Please consider how you have used this ability in the past, as your words have the power to either build or break bridges. Did self-interest drive your remarks, or did they align with my heart? Dread or frustration illuminate this message of desire. Share this video with someone who may be in need of a little grace today. Are you aware of your activities and what you have completed? Every action you take, regardless of its size, leaves an impact akin to throwing a stone straight into a pond. Your selections waves intensify a little bit after the fact. Your actions rely on them, my child, even though you may not always understand the immediate consequences. They affect not only your life, but also the lives of everyone in your immediate vicinity, including your friends, family, and even complete strangers you will never again see. Since I created you in my image, you bear a significant responsibility. Your actions should mirror my justice, mercy, compassion, and love, yet occasionally you act rashly, selfishly, or out of fear, leading to harm, division, and chaos. Now, I want you to review the choices you have made so far. What kind of waves have you been creating in the past? Did pain and conflict or beauty and love cause these waves? You must understand, my baby, that no matter how far away the waves spread, they will always come back to me, because I am the God of redemption. I will make even the worst moments beautiful. You must be willing to pass up options and understand the consequences. My little baby, do you realize what you've done? You wonder, have you not? that ends in darkness, and it embraces the path of gentleness once again. You've allowed the distractions of this international journey to distance you from me. You strayed from the path I set for you, allowing fear, joy, or uncertainty to cloud your judgment. But even now, 
am reaching out to you again. To get back to me, am calling you. I want you to understand that you can generally reach out to me. No mistake is too big, no failure is too profound, and no distance is too enormous to keep you from my love. I can see the depths of your heart, and I know that you secretly long for us to be together once more. You yearn to walk in the gentleness and experience the pleasure and tranquility that come with being with me. I'm waiting for you here with open arms. You don't want to come back to me in a perfect state. It's not your goal to know everything. You really want to show me your heart, to admit that you've long strayed from the path, and to take the first step back toward the path of justice. I can help with the rest of the protocol and meet you there. You've done things that have distanced you from me, my child, but I'm giving you a method once again. Turn your heart back to me and repent. Give up the worries, the guilt, and the humiliation that have kept you back. I want to see you experience the fullness of life that I have planned for you because I love you with all of my heart. Recovery is the goal of repentance, not punishment. When I urge you to repent, I'm giving you the opportunity to be whole again, realign your heart with mine, and walk in the freedom that comes only from my grace. I'm not asking you to remain in humiliation or to mope over your sins. Even admitting your choices diverged you from me is a first step toward healing. Repentance is a gift, a present that enables you to place your sins, mistakes, and weight on my shoulders, knowing that I will always forgive. I don't hold your history against you, sweetheart. Because the East comes from the West, I firmly establish your crimes even as you turn to me in repentance. I no longer forget them. You've carried burdens beyond your capacity. Your mistakes have weighed you down and prevented you from experiencing the fullness of my love, but I assure you that I have forgiven you. My forgiveness is sufficient to cover every transgression, every failure, and every mistake. Please come to me and tell me what's on your mind and it'll handle the rest. Transfer the blessing, my dear one. Share this message with three tired people and let them feel my presence through you, my darling child. Are you aware of your accomplishments? You've stopped yourself. You've reached the realization that you can't do this alone. And that's the start of something beautiful. My darling, this marks the beginning of a new season, a new chapter in your life, and a fresh start for our journey together. I want you to realize that every day is an opportunity to start again. Your past or future choices don't matter. My mercies are fresh every morning. A new day has begun. My sparkling start gives you a chance to walk in the light, live my will, and experience the joy and tranquility of being in my presence. We don't use your past to define you. With the help of my love, which is constant, steadfast, and everlasting, you are characterized rather than defined by your flaws. Nothing can take you away from reality since you are my favorite baby. I want you to consider your identity and accomplishments. Because you are mine, I have chosen you, set you apart, and described you as walking in the gentleness of my love. Your coronary heart's position is more important than anything else, even if your decisions do rely on it. Are you trying to find me? Are you choosing to follow my methods even when they are challenging? I'm with you all the time. I can never leave you, my kid. I can never leave you. Remember that I am directing your steps, so you are never really alone on your journey. You have chosen to return to me, which lights your way and keeps you near my heart. And that choice fills my heart with unfathomable delight. Continue to walk in my thoughts my love, and let my love guide every step you take. We respectfully ask that you consider supporting our efforts to share the truth of God. Just buying an espresso may help expand the audience and influence of our YouTube channel. Your contribution is a blessing, and we really appreciate your generosity. Beloved, love children, never forget that I am always here for you.
prepared to unravel any tangle in your mind and heart. When you approach me, you may not need to arrange everything in a courteous manner. Instead, feel free to share your naughty problems and unresolved matters in order to reveal your true form. The misunderstandings of others exacerbate many of your difficult circumstances, making it hard to distinguish between yours and theirs. Only you are responsible for your mistakes and offenses, not others. I'm here to help you navigate these challenging situations and choose the best course of action for you going forward. Christianity is a timeless progression, an epic journey of change. Untangling some knots from your past may also seem difficult, particularly if they include individuals who continue to cause you pain. It is crucial to keep your turn closer to me, seek my presence, and have trust in my time to uncover the complexity and eliminate darkness from your journey rather than being mired in a self-mirrored picture or obsessing over answers. Accept that there are unsolved difficulties, but don't let them take over your life. Your gift and unending desire are my presence in your reality. Sometimes, in times of constant upheaval, persistently difficult circumstances might become a significant part of your life. Pay close attention to the rumblings in your head. Ongoing difficulties have the power to gradually take over your thoughts and increase in importance until they eclipse everything else. Share this knowledge with me as you acquire it. As you attempt to break free from this agonizing obsession, release your emotions. Recognize your limits when confronted with difficulties and submit to my imposing presence. Even when a dilemma consumes your thoughts, it may cause anxiety. I encourage you to give that weight to me, knowing that my concern for you is constant. Regardless of how often it comes your way, embrace the work and push yourself to do it. Persistence is essential. Every time you confide in me about your troubles, you elevate our conversations by turning your attention from difficulties to the warmth of my body. Express your appreciation for my thought-provoking topic. Always remember that I risk my life for you and advocate for you. Your presence is an incredible gift. These days, show gratitude and open your fingers. Consider me your guide and your companion, but know that I am also your ultimate source of life. All Advent begins with me. You are seeking my eternal nature on this day I have given you. I am at your side, always watchful and steadfast in my presence, bringing together bright, joyous days spent with me. In the midst of difficult situations, your happiness and the joys I hold will grow tremendously. With unshakable faith, take my hand, I will guide you, dear. Your religious journey is a valuable treasure beyond measure, but your physical life is essentially a beautiful gift. Those who fail to understand my true essence will remain apart indefinitely, while those who belong to me will remain united forever. Because I saved you by employing it, undeservedly preferentially via perception, you may own an exceptional form that remains always free from sickness or exhaustion. Let your gratitude for this unachievable gift fill you with endless happiness. I have no control over your moments, therefore, place your trust in me. Dear one, in helping you to be a self-believer in the face of change and uncertainty, realizing that you are not in control of your own life may be liberating. Accept this life of death. You will find more freedom as you enjoy my rule. In not advocating that you have a fatalistic or passive approach. With devotion, channel your energies and powers. Look for me in every thought and duplicate everything around you. I'm seeking myself in the most expected places since I have a knack for the unexpected. Because of the power of your moments, I've created the beauty of these days and I'm seeking your advice to organize its complexities and events. There's no need for you to rush the process. Haste often leads to anxiety, and I've cautioned you to maintain composure. If you let me control the beat, I can provide you with a peace beyond all understanding in a world full of perils and uncertainty. For those who maintain their faith, there is no genuine danger. 
It is human nature to enjoy times of vulnerability. In heaven, you will live forever and leave a magnificent legacy that cannot deteriorate. Furthermore, I maintain control over everything, including your life and those who are costly to you. Nothing can happen to you or them that goes beyond what I allow. The truth is that war has been a constant worldwide since Rondu Wying's founding. The fall from grace in the Garden of Eden turned the world into a dangerous place where good and evil clash in a never-ending conflict. It's critical to be calm and attentive. Remember, you have already defeated your greatest enemy. I've overcome everything, and with my support, you stand among the winners. You will find peace inside me, and as the darkness grows, you will always feel at ease. Remember that you are the lighthouse of wisdom in this field. Focus your energy on things you can control and overcome your feelings of relaxation. Revisit these thoughts, but don't allow them to dominate your mind. Rather, use your energy on lighting up the planet I have given you. Use your resources, abilities, and time to fight the shadows. Light up the arena with my light. Your brightness radiates from me and I am the last light that lights even the darkest situations. I've called you to embrace my majesty from my person and giants. My darling, you masterfully learn this by embracing the authentic essence of your true self. Give this message a thumbs up if it touched you. Commit yourself wholeheartedly to seeking my presence, dear one. Pay attention to my message and my essence so that you may comprehend my purpose and thrive in beauty. Being with me lifts your soul by offering consolation and a suggestion. I give you the strength to develop into a lighthouse for everyone in your vicinity. Your prayers are not only murmurs in the emptiness, they reach my world of luminous light. Call my name, and I will answer and show you wonderful and powerful miracles. I don't care about the big things in life, but I value those who are willing to think things through. My heart brims with joy as you share your knowledge about excellence with me, driven by a passion for learning. As you stand by my side, in changing your thoughts, your eagerness to take in my information illuminates the aspirations to which I've called you, exposing the wealth of the remarkable legacy you possess, anticipating the experience of living with me in the holy city where divine radiance bestows everlasting illumination. My essence illuminates your mind, dispelling darkness and revealing the truth. Old beliefs may lurk in many secret places, but my soul is empowered to uncover and destroy them. Your cooperation is crucial. When my inner light illuminates a painful concept, thought patterns become difficult to erase. Capture it by writing it down and giving it to me to discuss. It'll help you see the falsehoods and replace them with heavenly truth. You'll discover the power to free yourself from the agony of illogical thinking resulting from alarming news as you reflect on my essence and message. Include the task of repeatedly going over the same idea. With perseverance, you will obtain increased freedom and a greater understanding of my presence. I've looked for you, and I'm willing to get a thorough understanding of you. I understand every aspect of you. Even before you say a word, I have a complete understanding of you. You shouldn't fear this clarity your concern, for me will protect you. You continue to have a revered place in my family. Our close bond acts as a powerful remedy for the loneliness that I experience. Bring your prayers to me when you're feeling lonely or anxious, even if I can sense your silent requests. Saying them out loud may help you think more clearly since I keep your situation very near. There is no need for explanations. You might jump right in and ask for my assistance with your contemporary problems. Spend some time relaxing in my company and enjoying the joy I provide. I will strengthen your path, protecting your feet from any errors. Do not dwell too much on the future and your ability to manage it. Since I alone possess the knowledge of your true future and am well aware of your talents, I have the ability to change your situation, either gradually or profoundly. I amplify your life's journey to demonstrate my active involvement. 
I get joy in fulfilling your desires and directing your life to prevent unnecessary hardship. Remember that I am a guardian for everyone who comes to me for comfort. Your responsibility on this journey is to trust me, communicate with me, and travel with me in a spirit of joyful dependence. I may extend your trip to compensate and protect you, but I won't take away your life missions. Joy is a decision. The decision of pleasure is always yours to claim, even if the circumstances may be beyond your control. I create you in a way that is more brilliant than usual, placing you just below the divine. Your high reputation in my field gives you the capacity to think and make decisions. Your mind holds immense power as it shapes your feelings and actions. Therefore, strive to cultivate intelligent and positive thinking. When you are feeling hopeless, pause to reflect and acknowledge that I am all around you. I have given you my spirit. I will always study and love you wholeheartedly. This holy power inside you has infinite energy to align your thoughts with the timeless principles found in the Bible. The scriptures have a spiritual assurance that I am always present. Throughout your journey, remain vigilant for my presence. At first, your focus may be entirely on your difficulties, but keep looking until you see the light of my spirit shining through your difficulties and bringing back glimpses of joy. I lead the one I love. Discipline acts as a compass, molding you toward a greater purpose. Even if discipline is necessary, it may cause pain and sadness when you regard my topic as an expression of my love. This stands in stark contrast to the fleeting joys of the past. You could experience joy while you go through difficult times, just as the early disciples did. In this regard, you are at a crucial juncture. Either give me your whole attention, or go off on your own path. You know my strength is love, but enter my world with hope. Ask me to show you the knowledge I want to gather and the improvements you should make. Ask for confirmation of my undying love, and feel the warmth of my divine nature as you look at my face. Discuss this video with someone who needs comfort and peace. I am the Sovereign of Serenity, and you always need my peace, just as you need me to be there whenever life falls into place naturally. It's simple to forget how much you depend on me, yet when difficulties arise, you find yourself broken and troubled. You eventually find your way back to me, yearning for my peace. Even though it can be challenging to accept while your spirit is still alive, I voluntarily offer you this priceless gem. How much more wonderful it is to be with me forever. You find safety, security, and wholeness within my embrace. Released from the burden of your restless endeavors, come to me with the concerns that haunt your spirit. You can trust me to consider your details and diligently monitor these burdens. Trust me with your worries and anxieties because my situation is serious. Take a moment to find comfort in the manifestation of my devoted care, because I am your unfailing guardian. You lose your completeness when you veer off course and leave me behind. My subliminal reminder to get back in touch with your initial enthusiasm is the burden you bear at such moments. I want to be at the very core of your thoughts, emotions, dreams, and efforts, since it is inside this harmony that you find meaning in life. My Immaculate Decree keeps me by your side as you journey closer to God. Yes, there will be obstacles on your path, but don't give up. I have overcome all that is within me. You will find completeness in me, complete protection and unfailing protection. Remember that I, your Sovereign, have the highest authority over all nation-states, both on Earth and in space. When you are on assignment, searching for me, and carrying your burdens, remember my essence. Refrain from opposing me or asking me to align with your agenda. Instead, recite David's words in prayer, but I trust in you, O Lord. I declare you're my God. I hold my moments within your draw close. Whether you can sense my essence or not, dearest, I am always here to assist you. 
You could sometimes find yourself in a desolate place without my kind presence, but you can still call out to me and know that I'm there and willing to assist. I instruct everyone who is looking for me to voice my call with gentle religion, putting your doubts behind you, letting go of your hurts, and asking for my guidance. Then return attention to my grandeur and vitality, my beauty, and my splendor. Declare your sincere appreciation for the favors I have bestowed upon you and uphold the bestowal of your lives. You may discover my limitless nature, delight in it, and acknowledge my magnificence in your admiration and thankfulness. Focusing on me and my belongings will expand your appreciation of my magnificence and unwavering love. Savor the potent essence of my may. Slake your soul's need with the peace and joy that emanate from my essence. Give this present to three souls who are in need of my grace. Baby, if my words have brought you peace. These days, I'm at your side, watching out for you at every turn. According to the revered Isaiah, I want to include your divine presence in me as a calm assurance. While the arena may celebrate loud proclamations and lavish promises as signs of power, true power stems from calm faith in me and my promises. Enjoy the fact that I am a vibrant divinity rather than a dead statue. The everlasting being is me. Although I have experienced death in the past, I now live forever. I approach you with love and gentleness, yet my power is limitless. As you live in my presence, Connect with me in unwavering trust, like my posts, and share your moments with me. Let the holy language illuminate your prayers. Come to me in soft, loving whispers. I direct my energy toward you, divine. I am so full of beauty and genuineness. Grace embodies the unending love and desire I offer you a deep pleasure that shields you from conceit when you receive something you haven't worked for. Grace is a priceless gift that ensures your salvation for all eternity. My grace will always shine upon you, my love, as you acknowledge me as your Redeemer. Give yourself up to my boundless love and celebrate my deliverance because I have a deep, undying, and unrelenting love for you. I no longer only represent the core of reality. I am the actual embodiment of fact itself in a world shattered by a deluge of data tainted with deceit and guile. I give you the knowledge of unchanging, everlasting truth as the last truth, creating an unshakable foundation upon which you may confidently stand. The steady foundation gives you the ability to shine a light on the dark corners of a chaotic and dynamic environment. Let your light shine so that countless individuals might see it too and find their faith in me. Because of the excellent care, gratitude endures. Defend yourself from the toxicity of entitlement, a decremental mindset that anticipates the universe to fulfill your needs. Despite its widespread prevalence, this misconception contradicts biblical teachings. Christians ought to avoid any brother who is lazy, according to the Apostle Paul. Paul worked tirelessly to provide a path for others to follow, demonstrating unwavering devotion even established a rule that forbade a worker from eating if they refused to work. Gratitude is a profound appreciation for the riches that are already in one's life, while entitlement is the belief that one is naturally deserving of certain things. If I had been able to give you what is rightfully yours, you would have ended up in complete despair with no hope of redemption. You have achieved salvation by employing divine desire, Feeling entitled to more than you already possess will cause you to be sad. But having a grateful heart will make you happy. Furthermore, your expression of gratitude to me is authentic, brimming with profound acknowledgement and awe. I desire to use the serenity you have received through me to provide comfort to others. As a dedicated believer, my presence and comfort are more than sufficient to fulfill your desires regardless of the difficulties that may emerge. Every challenge you take on as purpose, perseverance may strengthen your character and enable you to support others through their struggles. Give me a percentage of your difficulties and ask me to use them for my next layout. Seek refuge from war. 
but remain aware of its hidden riches as you come to me for help. You grow and learn important things that enable you to comfort others through their own difficult circumstances. Your empathy for the pain will permeate their life. Your capacity to provide comfort is at its strongest when you see others facing difficulties like those you have faced in the past. One might develop a deep sense of serenity through life's hardships because, while suffering may accompany hardship, it also brings the peaceful benefits of unique characteristics. You can depend on me to guide you through every moment with unfailing assurance. One second at a time, I illuminate the route for an unmarried day. If you are brave enough to see into the future, you may find best the blankness of doubt my face casts onto you entirely right now, because it is in this space that you find my steadfast, ravenous love, child. Accept my calling so that I might be a conduit for my grace. Your gift makes it easier for my message to reach people throughout the world. Join me in my endeavor by clicking the thank you button. You may get my many blessings. I love you in ways that go beyond the deepest human bonds. Even if she manages to forget the child by her side, I will always remember you. You continue to hold such immense significance for me that I have inscribed your name on the palms of my fingers. It would be impossible to remove you from my thoughts. I want you to really embody my love, which goes beyond simple knowledge of the divine presence inside. Your core is here to guide you. The pursuit isn't really worth it in its entirety, as I like the significant amount of the divine presence remodeling into a vessel that is completely filled and bursting with me. You may now fully embody my love in a manner that has never been possible before. Be wary of prioritizing other people's approval over your own. One consequence of autumn is that people become overly preoccupied with other people's opinions. Worries about social or professional success, physical attractiveness, and typical advertisements for makeup and stylish clothing fuel this preoccupation. Stop letting other people's opinions obscure who you really are. I've kindly shielded you from the ability to read other people's thoughts. Their perceptions of your reality don't fit with your way of existence. People's thoughts are often unreliable due to their imperfections, weaknesses, and uncertainties. Even though they may praise you for your presence, their true opinions can create a compelling narrative. Even though you're imperfect, only I see you in my ideal splendor. Instead of striving for other people's approval, try to see my eyes on you. My love for you radiates from me. Every day presents a unique set of challenges. One consequence of this reality is that you must equip yourself to face challenges on a daily basis. I'm here to help you overcome these obstacles with unflinching strength and assurance. I expected events don't remain a mystery to me since I comprehend them. Of all things, I am the beginning and the end. In addition, I am at your disposal to guide and console you through the rough seas of life. Embracing challenging circumstances in your daily life can boost your capacity to fully engage with the moment your vibrant mind yearns for challenging circumstances to overcome. If you don't have any worthwhile intellectual challenges, you may find yourself thinking about the future all day long. I am directing you to preserve your awareness of my essence in the present. Difficulty should no longer prevent you from enjoying my presence. Rather, they should draw you nearer to me when you join me in facing them head-on, as we tackle your difficulties aspect by aspect. Your domestication guarantees your ability to dominate, and my presence increases your enjoyment. Love is the epitome of perseverance. Among the qualities of Christian love, the Apostle Paul places the highest value on perseverance, being patient entails handling difficult situations with poise, persevering through protracted delays, and dealing with harsh people. Paul's perspective on perseverance stands in stark contrast to our culture, often overshadowed by love. However, there is a remarkable exception to this rule. Devoted parents who put their children's needs ahead of their own, 
The responsibilities of caring for infants and toddlers instill a strong sense of perseverance in these parents. The fourth fruit of the Spirit is patience, so I want my followers to love each other with patience. My soul thus exhorts you to succeed in this daring endeavor. I usually realize how amazing and unwavering my love is for you. Are you looking for divine instruction that will enable you to share my immense, lasting love with others? I look at you with a limitless supply of love these days. I am showering you with blessings, wrapping you in kindness, and making my choice visible to everyone. The heavens have diagnosed your steadfast commitment. Heavenly curiosity is watching your path at every turn. Even at your best moments, acknowledge the daily work you make to improve and grow. Your enthusiasm and unflinching commitment to this perceptual voyage are radiant. You face fearsome obstacles with unflinching courage, maintain an uncompromising status in the face of failure, and embody my very being in your life, my baby. I know the strain you bear in your dedication to raising your loved ones. I've seen the silent tears you shed for the weight of your problems and your lonely times of introspection. Understand that I serve as the intermediary, listening to your heartfelt pleas, I'm proud every time you approach me with your soul. I understand how you've struggled with doubt and questioned whether you'll ever find the answers to your deepest questions. I have seen how the enemy tried to sow the seeds of despair during those times of hardship and upheaval in order to test your faith and bravery. He wants to assign the standard, but I am ready to provide you with a prosperous living. Get in touch with me and join a network where my words will uplift and fortify your spirit. Subscribe right away because I have a lot to say that will give you peace and hope. I beg you to keep your faith strong, stick to your principles, and don't let anything make you change your mind, my son. Stand firm, my daughter. Your second chance has arrived. A time of greatness and the realization of your unwavering vision. Sooner or later, the moment you have been looking forward to is here. Don't worry to always a little good for your call. Today marks the greatest moment I've ever devoted to you. Your steadfast faith will undoubtedly pay off, enhancing your life with many advantages amid the endeavors of others around you. As I brighten every course you are taking, I will provide you with unmatched benefits and assistance, ensuring that shame won't ever affect you again. These days, I provide you a wealth of opportunities and benefits, transforming your lives into ones of extraordinary wealth. We are to blame for the Euro's financial difficulties and heavy debt. I promise you abundant gifts to improve every aspect of your life, material and spiritual. You will be joyful and sing songs of gratitude in my praise. Continue your faith in me and see how your life is filled with amazing things. My attractiveness will inspire you, provide you with resources, and create opportunities for all your interests. Hold within you the assurance that I will come at the precise moment you need me. Hold on to your beliefs because only they can help you overcome life's challenges. Always nurture your deepest desires. Remember that my commitment to you is unwavering, and my promises are unbreakable. I will stand by your side until I complete my heavenly endeavor for your life in a magnificent manner. At the difficult circumstances and challenges, keep in mind that I will be with you during the whole process. I will hold you in my gentle grasp no matter how fiercely the storms of life may also rage. Look at me, because I am the wellspring of your courage and ambition. While you are exhausted, let me lift your burdens. Every promise I have made will come to pass at the appointed time, so I stand ready to encourage you with assurance of my steadfast devotion. Recognize that people typically follow you. I support you in every conflict, endeavor, and crucial moment. Am by your side throughout every moment of joy and struggle. Always keep in mind that you are my priceless creation created with a holy purpose and blessed with immense presence when you hear the voices of fearless children and scale majestic mountains. You will find the paths that lead you to righteousness by listening to my guidance and the facts in my word. 
The presence of my spirit inside you will provide clarity and insight in the midst of confusion. Regardless of your achievements or value, my dear, remember that my love for you is unconditional and freely given. These days, I beg you to live up to those words. Let them come back to you, soothe your spirit, and soften your path. Keep in mind that I am your best. As a heavenly being, creator of the universe, and parent of your soul, I love you infinitely and am forever committed to you. I promise that if you trust in me, I can uplift you and help you succeed in all you do. Realize that you cannot bear these heavy burdens alone at this crucial juncture in your life. Dealing with a variety of difficult circumstances alone can lead to exhaustion, annoyance, and vulnerability. As a result, I urge you to let go of all your concerns. Since I am fully aware of your deepest thoughts and sincere desires, I see no need to conceal anything. I am your last source of guidance. Therefore, place your whole confidence in me. I am always here, observing every step you take. Even while you are unconscious, allows me to guide you and give you deep insights so you can expertly manage the gifts I provide you. I want to beautify and embellish every aspect of your life. The doors of plenty will open for you as you return to your faith in me like a child, and the universe will unveil its mysteries, bestowing upon you heavenly riches to uplift your soul in peace and joy. Have faith in me. I will elevate your pursuits, interests, and objectives. Despite hardship, I will always favor you. If you have faith in me, you will witness my growth in every endeavor, as my goal is for you to thrive and shine brightly, like the first light of dawn, unflinchingly until the day is full. The challenges and uncertainties of life on earth can test your ideas at times. Feel secure as you face those challenging circumstances. I will consistently be present through your appearance. Consider my role in your life as a gift that benefits you and others who value me. Your fate is certain in me. So stop letting the responsibilities of today and the fears of tomorrow drag you down. Trust me, my darling, and I will illuminate your path to success, not failure. If this message has made you feel better, please share it with three people who need my love and light in their lives. Remember that real success and prosperity transcend material possessions. Restoring it is no longer necessary. At Unum, the pursuit of my domain and virtue takes precedence over material gain. Otherwise, take my words to heart and hold them dear with all your heart. I promise that I can take care of everything for you. I will fulfill all of your desires and ensure that all of your goals and pursuits succeed under my heavenly favor. I make this decision to generously share the wealth you have received as a gift with others. Come to me little baby, and find strength and comfort. They'll shape you into the epitome of knowledge and confidence. Feel free to entrust me with any topic. Accept it as truthful to the best of my ability. Difficult circumstances will no longer defeat you, I promise. Don't give up, as adversity serves to fortify your spirit and validate your trust in me during times of endeavor, hardship, or bury. Get in touch with me, and he'll respond. I will give you deep wisdom, and the ability to overcome any obstacle. He'll open up seemingly insurmountable barriers and lead you to unexpected opportunities so you may elevate your life once again. To receive divine favor in all your endeavors, I implore you to submit all your acceptances as true in me, along with your budget, objectives, and desires. Remember that everything is within my control, and I am pleased to improve and elevate you in any way that I can. Trust that you will succeed, have peaceful family relationships feel powerful, and have emotional balance. You constantly remind me of my all-encompassing love, my dear one, so believe in me and allow me to guide you. So embrace love and grasp it. I will guide you into prosperous nation-states and via the paths of morality. 
You are my greatest treasure and the center of my existence. Thus, I will always be there to support you. Don't fear the future anymore. Because I possess amazing designs, you will see your life refreshed and brimming with amazing things as you go on your journey with me in faith and commitment. Your path will succeed if you have faith in me, your creator, your parent, and your sustainer. Can these words also resonate with you, my love, and elevate your soul? Could the abundance of gifts that will adorn your lives also help you comprehend my love? Don't doubt my nature or words live and cherish them. Maintain a constant feeling of gratitude for your current blessings inside the riches that lie ahead. Gratitude will reveal the wealth that is currently all around you and empower you to embrace even more gifts. Continue firmly believing what I have promised. When you work with devotion and skill, you no longer allow circumstances or worldly distractions to pull you off your path. Utilize your skills and potential to succeed and be honest and kind so you can reap the rewards. I will elevate and adorn you in every aspect of your lives, so flourish. This message contains the healing of your soul, so rest in peace. Remember that I am in the grasp of the impossible. Remain composed and have unshakable faith. I have helped you with this before, and I will do it again. I will calm the roaring oceans of doubt inside your coronary heart, just as my voice commands the winds and storms to cease. Come over to me now, and I will help you will provide you the comfort you're looking for. Your turbulent thoughts and anxieties will dissipate, making it easier for you to understand your thoughts and grasp your awareness. I wish you peace in your nights and in your days. You inherit many things, but sometimes you forget them, allowing your fantasies about amazing things to eclipse your actual wealth. Keep your cool. I beg you once again to ignore the rumors, the news, and the dangers that others could give you. Even if you bear the weight, I maintain your vitality and choose your destiny despite the resistance of legions. Of your own folly, set aside your worries. You are my beloved, and I will protect you from evil when mayhem abounds and others fall prey to fear. Stand together and show courage and strength. Don't be afraid. It'll be at your side. This is the best example of love you could see and experience today with unshakable faith in yourself. Through this channel, in connecting with your heart and addressing your doubts, embrace me, dear, and let my words of truth and grace speak to your heart. You will learn the principle and power every day if you subscribe. The depth of my love for you is so great that I can now properly and firmly express it. I'm healing the wounds caused by people who will disappoint you, and am getting rid of the contempt that has characterized you. Trust that every challenge you've encountered will serve a meaningful purpose. These days, you embody unprecedented energy, deep knowledge, and dazzling maturity to support those you care about and to encourage others who have persevered through similar struggles. You are now experiencing the moment of your ascent. Your enemies will return to disturb your peace and seize your surrender if you let them, knowing your abilities. Losing faith and falling into fear will cause tension again, but my love for you, mercy, and the Holy Spirit will protect you from further harm. I will elevate you all over again, despite failure and opposition. Don't think that I've shifted my attention from you. Resist succumbing to the enemy's schemes. You'll be there to help. My determination to confront you will not waver, even if your perception lapses and darkness obscures your thoughts. He'll cleanse your soul, teach you, and shield you from pressure to leave my love. You outdo everyone in all you do. My power has challenged you. You have renounced corruption and surrendered your soul to me. In your own words, you have professed your faith in me as your father, mother, and redeemer. You have shown unwavering and unrelenting commitment. You stand out from those who complain and avoid my company when I face difficulties. They go off and offer their complaints to the first soul they see, disregarding their life 
family, fate, or wealth. They treat my redemption with contempt. They pollute this holy love with their actions. Yet my love for them endures. I will continue to keep you away from the evil doer and pray for their souls. Do not let others' contempt change your opinion of what I have said. Keep moving forward and persevering. Don't wait for your progressive nation. I provide you limitless chances these days. I provide you with unchanging energy. Grow with unflinching confidence and face the difficulties and enemies that lie ahead with courage. The greatness that lies ahead of you is unaffected by your records. Even when everything seems to be falling apart, you trust me and it'll help. You found comfort in my heavenly embrace, and you will always feel unfailing safety in my presence. Include your inner peace and contentment, because you live under the protection of the Almighty. Have faith in my essence as energy to cleanse and forgive you. Hold on to this truth with steadfast faith. Keep your eyes wide open because I'm about to reveal a magnificent and amazing change in your life. You say, your loyalty to me and faith in my power have led you to accept the reality that I have forgiven. Let go of the burden that your P.S. caused you. I have banished transgressions to the emptiness where they will perpetually vanish. They no longer reside in a self-proach observing you grapple with issues that may have been long-standing and long gone pains me. I have renewed your soul, energized your mind, and transformed your essence. Immerse yourself now in my precious message and let your voice be filled with suggestion and energy. Every day, reflect on my promises and commands and avoid descending into despair. You must choose your own route. You now have destiny in your hands. My presence shields you and keeps you close to me. It'll protect you from the universe's attacks, even if it turns against you. Your intelligence is brave, and my knowledge will strengthen it. Lighten your heart and elevate yourself above people who hurt you with their harsh words and awful attitudes. You should steer away from friendships, in my opinion, and locations that can divert you off your course. I want your energy to remain vibrant and fiery. I grant you a future full of lifestyles, peace, and plenty of advantages. Unaffected by grief and despair, if you raise me in the finest possible location for your heart, make my presence a priority in your lives and uphold the promises I make to you, my love, you will discover freedom, plenty, and divine favor. Click to enter and experience the totality of my love and grace. Come and become near to me. With the support of the warmth of the community and the depth of my teachings, we can travel this path of faith together. Come together with your fellow believers now. Listen to my purposes, because you carry these words in your heart. Forever and ever I include you and keep watch over you. I steadfastly support you. Keep those words near and dear to your heart when the burden becomes too much to bear. When grief strikes, remember me and don't stay by yourself. The simple truth is that I am here to support your journey. Give me a name, keep me close to your heart, and allow your tears to pause so that they may feed the darkness of the afterlife alongside your grief. Keep your soul from absorbing the terrible times. Refrain from thinking or acting in ways that will cause you to lose your peace of mind and ultimately fail. Keep in mind that I am the one who created the vegetation. I used my wonderful blood to atone for your sins. Remember my amazing return, because I have come to resurrect your dreams, elevate your life, provide you eternal life, and strengthen your soul. You have endured many hardships, but here you are. You are my children unflinching and rising again. My vitality is contained inside you. These days, nothing and no one will stand in your way as you plow forth on your intended path. I will give you deep insights as you become stronger, open up new paths and clear away any obstacles. Many of the things you thought were longer and will come back to haunt you. Your steadfast faith in what I have spoken is the path to freedom, prosperity, peace, and the gifts you choose. 
Elevate yourself and take on difficulties. Don't let your opponent weaken your determination. You have heard my desire to elevate and assist you now that you know my ideas. It is now your responsibility to believe in me, to seek me, to behave as I say, and to obey me. Climb and go ahead. You will succeed. You are my child. I have the authority to carry out my responsibilities, and I will make the final decision. As we traverse this challenging distance, trust me and extend your hand. Your perspective has always supported your will and self-confidence, so don't let difficulties and hardships weaken them. I have not abandoned you in any way, and I will not abandon you during this challenging time. Even in the midst of difficult circumstances, my tireless ideas and vision will guide you to a place of wealth and peace. If you stick to your guns and stay positive, you can overcome them. Come to me in the morning, stay with me in the light, and find comfort in my company when night falls. The universe trembles as your voice rises in exultation, as you pass with conviction asking me to guide your loved ones and protect them from danger and illness. Even though you may not understand it now, humble yourselves before me because I enjoy hearing your prayers. Despite the world's abandonment, it'll always support you. Even if everyone who claims to love you disappoints you, my love is greater, and I can always be there for you. Your family circle, your health and future are under my expert supervision respect valued and better protect them respect your advantages recognize their true value i guarantee that your benefits will increase and that i will give you even more significant riches that will last a lifetime if you remain committed to the little things and hold on to what i have given you throughout difficult times i deeply sympathize with your pain as i have mentioned previously your genuineness truly resonates with me Given my strong desire to do so, I will share my decision with you. Give me assurance that you will cherish my blessing during your sad times. Be certain that I hold you in my tender embrace. I engulf you in my holy body. My dear, you have my undying love. You are love. I chose you before you were even born, giving you a strong spirit that has carried on countless AFF fronts. Yeah, I'll show off your courage once again. You will come out of this task unscathed. I transfer my peace to you. Yeah, I'll remain steadfast. You are among the winners, never the defeated, and that is the timeless, unalterable truth. I will give you the strength and the means to conquer the enormous world that awaits you, standing tall and unflinching in the face of difficult circumstances. You have repeatedly asked for my opinion, and now, just before you, a fantastic chance presents itself. Don't give up if you still don't fully understand the significance of this amazing gift. Expand your intellect, cleanse your soul, and, as I often declare, incorporate my lessons. Within is the foundation and source of all the knowledge you desire. I stand with you now. Do not waver. Walk with confidence. Do not let difficult circumstances or those who want to discredit you via lies, deceit, and schemes divert your path. Realize that you are never truly alone. There is always someone around you. I hear your prayers, and I sense the true nature of your soul. Maintain your commitment. Let it never falter. Let your tears fall freely. They serve as a powerful symbol of your steadfast love and dedication for your children. The pricey creatures you care for must see your constant devotion. They should understand that a dedicated mother humbles herself every day, giving her deepest thoughts and emotions before they do. Keep reminding them of my genuineness, my deep love, and the amazing heavenly arrangement I've created for each of them. If your kids seem unresponsive, Love them and show your tears. Let them see how much their actions weigh on you. Every step is necessary for the odyssey. Have faith in me and know that each of your children deserves an extraordinary adventure. They may fall, but your prayers will shield them from their enemies' slander. Show your unwavering love. 
exhibit the ability to guide them if they stray, but generally maintain an open heart free from the influence of judgment. They ought to feel that you're welcome. You understand that your prayers are a constant defense over their life and that your love is unwavering and unchanging. Declare that your nourishing prayers have tremendous power and produce excellent outcomes. Your soul will leap with joy as you see the fruits of your hard work and patience. Consider me by your side and your children. My love for you is limitless. Your mistakes no longer define your lives, your goals, your skills, or your boundless potential. They are only stepping stones. For you, they no longer symbolize the fulfillment of my plans. If you have faltered, this is your path. Include forgiveness for your mistakes. Keep the enemy's dishonesty and blame at bay. Rise. Sweep the ashes of your descent away. Spread your wings and rise with unflinching courage. I use my effective essence to purify you. Failure may sometimes appear like the end of the arena, but to my children, it is a valuable lesson and a trip they should never repeat. Consider the past as the present, with shadows enveloping what remains. Lift your eyes and look forward, because I am giving you a magnificent assignment. I call upon you. I will reach out and give you the highest honor for those who have the courage to say these words and walk with me, standing firm against your enemies, for you will come out of this unarmed. I will protect you in every conflict you encounter, lead you with bravery on every adventure I guide you through. Allow my promises to recite inside your spirit, tame your imagination with my commands, incorporate your energy and courage, and dispel fear and despair with my powerful hold. I can support you and be even more of your strength. Even when you disagree and confront vulnerability, I will make sure you maintain resilience. I want you to know how much your presence means in my life. I favor it as a means of thriving, rising, and conquering things of everlasting importance. Prosperous benefits will find their way back to you. Family unity and reconciliation will thrive. You possess an invincible force. I have repeatedly expressed my love for you, untainted by shame, and I affirm it once more to uplift your soul. I truly appreciate you, and God has approved and authorized your recovery. I am the one who created your fate. Enhancement is what I have given you. I have forgiven you for your sins. Nobody has the right to judge, denigrate, mock, or discredit you. I have given you my choice and my devotion. You have now merited the heavenly things I want to give you. Don't reduce your price or undervalue the significance I have given you. Look into the mirror with recognition and appreciation. The sight of you listening to lies makes my heart ache. While your holy handbook embraces these phrases and preserves them with steadfast religion, it rejects the depth of my love and devotion favoring criticism of others instead. I created you with the intention of seeing you succeed. Here and now, I chose enhanced and placed you. Unfortunate circumstances, material circumstances, with the negativity that permeates your life don't necessarily determine your success. No power can stop the heavenly gifts that the heavens have planned and given, but you must commit to receiving them, to a firm decision. Will you believe what I say even if others raise doubts? Are you going to follow my advice or let enemies' whispers influence your choices? They want to confuse you, to impede your enjoyment, and to watch you fail. As I have said before, their goal is to destroy you. My dear child, you must cease allowing them to jeopardize the integrity of your lives. Come walk with people who are looking for my voice. Sign up and receive the words I have prepared to pour love into your heart. I prefer luxury and steering so that I may have deep affection, steadfast protection, and unending support. You will reside inside the manifestation of my peace, love, and faith. Exude steadfast vision. Instill in yourself the confidence that a prosperous and wealthy future awaits you. 
You care about me, you value me, and you believe in me. In your own words, tell me that you will always hold on to your perception, which you hold near to you, protected by my power, and that you no longer shudder in the presence of your enemies. I will reveal their existence to you. I will save you even if you are in danger. I will take action against those who surround you and plot against you. I will assist you, and within a few days, you will ascend, erasing your adversaries from memory. Many are filled with anger as they fight to defeat you. They no longer recognize that your most devoted guardian, your heavenly mentor, and your savior are by your side. Have faith and realize that anything is feasible. Have faith and act. Beside you, go on with purpose. Acknowledge the amplification of your faith. Now you have the ability to cross the seas and defeat all things dark. Engage in conflict and emerge victorious because you are not fighting this battle alone. You are now free of anxiety. You have reached the pinnacle of fearlessness. Set aside your concerns and uncertainties, raise your weapon, and continue fighting within the battle. Prepare yourself for the upcoming holy prayer. In any chosen situation, you will overcome the land that lies ahead. He'll give you the solution, and on the way there, yell, heal, and uplift countless people. Your relationships will flourish. Balance and tranquility will adorn your home. Hold my hand tightly, and you won't falter either. I am your mother or father, your Lord, and your healer. Say you believe in me with all your heart and hold on to that belief. I like you. I've been here, am here, and I will always be here with you. In times of turmoil, be steadfast. In times of peace, act decisively when you encounter an unwanted force that has entered your life without cause. It's far wiser to live a tranquil life, entrusting your faith to my affection and your problems to my care. I will guide you with my calming words, a remarkable beacon in the middle of a confusion. My light will penetrate the harsh shadows, intensifying until it awakens your soul to the profound truths. Accept this fact, as it will help disseminate the solution. Using my divine presence may reveal the way out of your difficult circumstances. He will lift your soul, bringing you peace, freeing you from worries and anxiety even while you are facing hardship, and allowing you to go forward with confidence free from sorrow and condemnation for past failures, to seize the victory. I have done it for you. Let my spirit fill yours, to incur with me regardless of what you look at, see, or like, accept my love and my promises. I interact with you to discern the exceptional destiny I have in store for you, and trust your destiny to my care. Give up your doubts and lead lives that are resolutely authoritative. Trying to help you drives me to ask for anything. I'm looking for your unwavering faith in me, and your confidence in my skills. I'm your perfect match because I'm strong and dependable. I'm deeply devoted to you, my feelings are pure, and no one loves you more than I do. Nobody watches you as closely at all hours as I do. I love you more than anybody else. I've always hugged you, and typically stood by your side. You must get over this. I experience a sense of inadequacy when I remember that your purpose isn't to linger on the past's guilt and retribution, which I've already forgotten in my own world. Pay close attention. Cast your sins into the ocean's depths. I will make them forgettable. You have to believe what I say, which is that there may not be a need to go into the dark depths of judgment once again. By looking for memories and emotions that I have erased, I no longer give the enemy the opportunity to cast the shadow of past sins that I have already forgiven. Perhaps no one wants to live with the same errors every day. Pay attention to the chances that lie ahead and what lies ahead. Put the past behind you and don't look back. I give you the strength to overcome obstacles, and a wonderful reward will appear after hardship great opportunities will find their way back to you. Darina should influence your opinions but that of me. Haters accuse and attack you, saying you don't deserve my benefits. 
grace or desire will find you reacting with the wealth of forgiveness and grace I have given you. I am your guardian. Improve with a steadfast solution because I will shield you from anybody who would do you harm. Do not dwell on past transgressions. Focus your attention on the future. Do not allow trivial matters to distract you. Embody my words with an open heart. Obtain the fact that I share with you. Respect my words with profound reverence. Treasure my offering, my spilled essence. I am awaiting your instruction and your steadfast loyalty with a plethora of remarkable and clever ideas. Find me and see my intent in every response. Listen, my darling, and let your soul find rest in the assurance of my unending love and wisdom. Have faith in me because I guarantee you will reap many rewards from your endeavors today. Accept those words today, not as passing noises, but as a holy message inside you, a soothing remedy for your soul, and a beacon to illuminate your journey. If what I've said has made you feel better, child, please spread the word about this gift. Those who are in need of my grace today understand that I, your greatest being, the creator of lifestyles, your heavenly father, and your unwavering guardian, have an unending love for you and an unending commitment to your happiness. I implore you to let go of the burdens that are pressing down on you at this very point in your lives. Don't set out on this journey alone anymore, because facing life's challenging circumstances without my support will only lead to exhaustion, infection, and a diminished spirit. Therefore, I implore you to give me the whole thing. Don't hide anything, for I already know the deepest recesses of your soul and your most genuine desires. Give me total control over your conviction in yourself, despite your inattention, in your constant support and protector. Permit me to guide you, teach you, and give you the tools to choose your path because I want nothing more than to see you thrive in every aspect of life as you place your faith in me. Paths of plenty will open up before you, and the skies will show off their riches, saturating you with holy riches that bring you unheard joy and peace. With every step you take, I will improve your endeavors, interests, and ambitions if you believe in my energy. My objective is to be your unwavering eye, even in the face of hardship. I will improve your efforts and help you achieve satisfaction if you trust my methods. It is my greatest desire to see you thrive as your life shines brightly, becoming brighter until it reaches its final glory. I understand that life on this earth may be difficult and unpredictable, and you may encounter situations that contradict your values. Rest assured, I will remain resolute when we face these obstacles, using your perspective and having faith in my ideas for you, as I am always a gift acting in your high-quality pastime, and serving everyone who values me. With me, your path is certain. So don't worry about what lies ahead or let the difficulties of the present drag you down are meant for success, not failure. Put your faith in me, and it'll guide your path. Recognize that true success and plenty extend beyond material wealth. Don't dwell on material belongings. Instead, be mindful of following my domain and unique characteristics, holding my lessons in the highest regard, and embracing them with open arms. I assure you that all you want may be yours, your earnest hopes and dreams will materialize, bringing to life the visions you have nurtured via your perseverance. Because you fulfilled my wish, you will bring prosperity to everyone around you. Spread the beauty you possess and remain generous at all times. Because of this, my loved one comes to me and asks for comfort. I will encourage, uplift, and help you. Don't be afraid to give me everything. Take it as real to the best of my knowledge. And never forget that obstacles won't stop you. Never falter in the face of difficult circumstances or adversity, as they will strengthen your belief and serve as a reminder of your reliance on me. Call for my assistance in times of conflict or misfortune and I will clear your reputation. I will give you deep understanding and the strength to overcome any challenge that comes your way. 
He'll open doors that seem closed and guide you toward opportunities, which is a great approach to improving your quality of life. Once again, I give you everything. Give me your budget, your objectives, and your desires, and watch as your work and all of your endeavors become amazing. Recognize that I maintain sovereignty over everything, and that my gifts will enhance and elevate your lives in every way. I promise that everything will work out perfectly for you. Your family relationships will be the most stable. You will feel energized and fulfilled emotionally, and you both will be able to give and receive love. I will constantly remind you through your aspects that my love for you is all-encompassing and goes throughout your lives. Put your trust in me and let me lead you, dear. I can bring you into areas where people congregate and down moral paths. Because you are my most treasured diamond and the light that illuminates my imagination and foresight, I will continue to stand firm by your side. Do not fear the future since I have excellent things in store for you. I will remain faithful in every aspect of your life. Join me on a journey of agreement and dedication and you will see the amazing transformations I bring to your lives, brimming with exceptional gifts. Hit the like button if this missy makes your day, my baby. Your excellent is me. Trusting me as your writer and supporter could help you succeed. May those pricey words resonate deeply with you and fortify your beliefs. May you perceive the essence of my love in the gifts intended to embellish your life. Do not question my intentions or my declarations. Embrace them with reverence and keep them forever in your heart. Express gratitude for your current possessions and the advantages that lie ahead. Being grateful can help you see the abundance in your life and give you the strength to accept even more blessings. Go forth, my love, with complete trust in my promises and dedication to information-driven work. Indeed, keep moving on unflinchingly despite the hardships of the world and the ephemeral diversions that are attempting to divert you. To succeed in your career and business, make the most of your exceptional talents. In every endeavor, Demonstrate unflinching integrity and limitless generosity. Then, you will most effectively see how I magnify your hand's efforts, bringing success and advantages to all aspects of your existence. Your difficulties and hardships will end sooner rather than later. Join me, my love, for I will abundantly reward your courage. Hold your speech with the highest attention, for I am pleading with you now to confront your melancholy, give up and break free. Even in the midst of uncertainty and darkness, I implore you to remain firm and unwavering. Refrain from allowing doubt to cleanse your mind or fear to penetrate your heart. Stands tall. I promise to be there for you no matter what, traveling with you through your difficult circumstances and trials. I will unwaveringly stand by your side to protect and guide you as you navigate this world. Therefore, Look up and call upon me, as I may be there to help. I will remain by your side. Even in difficult times, I'm here for you. You may be sure that I will always be there to support you. Remember, no matter how deep the darkness may descend, a new day will always come, and with every new day comes a danger, as no storm can withstand the return of peace. This lifestyle is short-lived, but my promise and those who believe in me endure. The floor underneath us will eventually disappear, just as the universe itself will, and all subjects will ultimately come to an end. You will eventually resolve the difficulties and trials you have faced. Think about what I said, since that could be the straightforward truth I share with you today. I can never abandon you or allow you to escape my grasp because I am right here, enveloping you in my love and directing your behavior with the greatest intelligence. Baby, never stop striding for perfection in every moment. Increase your goals and efforts and pursue your dreams. Become stronger with unwavering resolve. Ignore what those around you think. Don't let harmful rumors or twisted comments break your spirit. Listen to me. Pay attention to what I have to say. 
because I have the strength and blessing to carry out everything you set your mind to. I agree with your goals, and I will help you reach them. I can give you the tranquility you seek, a tranquility that transcends all worldly understanding, and may bring your soul peace and freedom. Toddler, I will always be at your side, watching your journey, and I can fully appreciate your hard work and commitment. You will soon be able to claim the whole that you have so passionately and devotedly sown. Your life will then be abundant, fully contented, and flourishing as you begin to gather the fruits you have long desired. When faced with difficult circumstances, you typically maintain your composure. Take courage and dignity, as nothing will weigh you down. I can bestow upon you the capacity to deceive in every temptation, and deed. Be brave and tall. Although your situation may seem overwhelming, I will always be with you. Always remember that harder things yield greater rewards. After all, what hardship now will not soon serve as a priceless tribute to your everlasting faith and unrelenting perseverance. I want you to walk with me, growing in love and soaking up my unending light. To join your brothers and sisters on this journey of grace and to receive my lessons, click to participate immediately. My dear, we will keep our faith and love for each other through both successes and failures. Keep in mind that every move you make, whether apprehensive or companionable, brings you one step closer to fulfilling the promises I made about your lives. Trust me, because I am your mother or father and your steadfast light. Let your heart be filled with peace and unflinching assurance as you reflect on those words and the realities I have taught you today. I am your ideal being and your go-to ally during times of conflict. Hold on to me quickly, and you will discover the drive for the path, the courage for the battles, and the joy in the victories that await you now, my dear, as you repeat my message. Consider whether you want to embark on a holy journey with a topic that is truly unique. We could explore new levels of idea, desire, love, or any other facet of your non-secular development. Every time you decide to go out on the journey, your heavenly handbook is there to guide you forward. Amen.